Listen, Henry, I understand. I know you miss doing stuff here, but this, I mean, this really got to me. I needed that money. I just withdrew the money so I could get something from the roadside, and all of a sudden, the money was gone. Okay, hold on. Just <laughs> hold on a bit, bro. <laughs> oh my god! Tina, yeah? It's true. I can see it. Oh, now you want to make me cry. You like money a lot. My sister, I do like money. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much, Henry. Thank you. Thank you, Henry. Thank you so, so much. Thank you. <laughs> I mean, we are the ones meant to be sending money because you are in a foreign country stalling while we are at home on strike mm -hmm. eating food. Come on, Chine. You know I'm not the type that likes to overly depend on mommy and dad. Well, okay. I do some part-time jobs here to raise some extra cash and pay. It's quite good. Really? That's great. Hmm. I trust your hustling spirit. <laughs> You are my hero! And you are my champ. I love you, bro. Thank you so, so much. <laughs> Say hi to mom and dad, yeah? Oh, well, I do. But I still feel like cursing that idiot who picked up my wallet. Uh-huh. Anyway, thank you, bro. I love you so much. And thank you for the money. <laughs> thank you. Bye. Bye. -ya. <laughs> I am super duper excited. I mean, this feels so good. I got my money back. Mm -hmm. Just like that. <laughs> Thank you very much for suggesting that we call Henry. You're welcome. Mm. You know, I'll do anything to make you happy and to see you happy too. Mm -hmm. But that does not include for feeding my eye waste. My sheer set. You know, your eye waste. Your nose waste smell. Are your money lost? Did you lose your money? Sounds like you. It's a no. No, This okay. it's a little bit torn here, okay. so I want you to run it all the way down. Okay. Mm? Right. Just Thank do you. it, eh? I will. Okay. Uh, please don't hold it too close because I don't want the dress to get too tight. It's okay. fine. Mm. I will be careful about it. Yeah, forgot to ask him. Um, how much is it? Mm. Don't worry about it. No. Anything you give me is fine. As soon as I did the job, person. Just tell me how much you are going to collect. I don't want us to start having issues when you're done with the dress. Like I said, do not worry yourself. We're not going to have any issue. Listen, bro. Appearance is not reality. Forget this big house you're seeing. We are not the privileged rich girls you are seeing us as. Oh, it's fine. Don't worry, I'll handle it. Okay? The reason we're saying this is that money talk right now unsettles my nerves. So. Oh, really? What happened to you? I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry uh, for asking him. No, it's it's okay. It's fine. The thing is, um, I lost my wallet today on my way to the market. Oh, your wallet? Sorry. How much was in it? I had um sixty-four thousand naira in the wallet. Sorry. Why are you asking? Did you by any chance see my wallet? Sorry, she's not by any chance accusing you. What she's trying to say is, did you by any chance ever hear someone probably talking about something like that that made you ask exactly how much is in the wallet? 
You know what? Let's just forget about my my wallet talk. How much are you charging for the amendments? Don't worry yourself. Money is not everything. No matter how big one's need for it is. I mean, just wow. A very intelligent, educated, philosophical Obioma. <laughs> that is great. You see, circumstances of life can turn someone into all sorts of things. But one should pray that when life hits you so hard that you don't lose your moral values. Even if you do, that you still pray to have a second chance to correct it. It's okay. Um, it's fine. You can go ahead and fix the dress Thank if you. that's how you want it. So as I was saying, give me your account number so that I can give you your urgent 2K. Uh, to what? Like I would do what? It's out uh, of my 64,000 naira. 30,000 naira. Ah, but you have to You're go. Like a Are you okay? I, I hope we didn't say anything to offend you. Come on, talk to us. What, what, what is it? I'm done. You're done? I'm so sorry for crying needlessly in front of you. I'm sorry. Are, are you sure you didn't see anything? At least come have your money. Hello? Excuse me? At least come have your money. What in God's name is wrong with him and who is he really? Interesting character, Joe. of our time. Please. I'm going out tonight, Mom. Aww. Where are you going, my angel? Well, nowhere in particular. I just want to go somewhere quiet, natural and calm. You know, somewhere where I could have my peace to complete my poem I have been writing since last week. Oh, you have started writing poems again? Yes, I have. God, it's been boring here. I mean, since the strike, I've been home doing nothing. I don't want to get fat, so I decided to start writing again, and it's been amazing. Especially today, her sister, who is her best friend, went to Enugu to take care of business for that. Mom, you did it. <laughs> you are too wise, this woman. That's why my father married you. Yes, sir. Your son is too plenty. <laughs> the truth is that if you and Chine are not my daughters, I would have found it really difficult believing that you are not twins. <laughs> Without clothes. <laughs> the kind of love and closeness that exists between the two of you makes me so proud. Mm. Well, you can go, but make sure you come back on time. Yes, sir. So can I go? Yes, but I can't wait to be the first to read that poem when you are done. Definitely, Dad. You must be the first person to read my poem. You know you're my best critic. You know that. Um, <laughs> All right, I'll see you guys later. Right, baby, take care of yourself. Okay, you too. Yeah. And be good. This is such a vibrant soul. Brilliant and lovely as well. Chine, you too. You're We're right. so blessed. We're blessed. We're blessed. Honestly. We're blessed. <laughs> Okay. 
Someone crying in the forest, and it's a man's voice. Who could it be? What could possibly make a man cry so openly in a lonely forest like this? Could it be he was injured? Yes, he must be badly injured and in need of help. Go and check him out. But what if he is a... He has stopped.
mother. My sweet mother. They say that the dead watch over their loved ones who are still alive. Mother, even though I did not meet you, I want you to know wherever you are, that your son, your blood, I love you so much, Mother. I love you so dearly. And I believe strongly in my heart that you love me deeply too. The reason you made my adopted mother to choose suffering in a strange land in order to save and bring me up. What then is happening now? What is going on now, mother? Because the suffering is too much. The suffering is so, so much. Mother, I need help. Please. The woman that helped me, my adopted mother, she needs help. We need help, mother. Please help me and thank God. Help me and thank God to come and help us. Help me and thank God. We need help physically and spiritually. Please. Please. But I please tell God. Tell God to save me from the claws of Madame Egothi. Tell God to save me from the torture she calls sex. She has been subjecting me to it almost every night. I am tired, mother. Thank God that I am tired. Thank God that I am tired. Come and save me, mother. Save me. I am tired. Save me. I am tired. I am tired. I am tired, mother. I am tired. <laughs> <laughs> Again? I think I have to go and find out what is really going on. I don't care about the potential danger. A human like me crying in the forest. People don't cry for fun. I'm so, so sorry. The prophet or the native doctor that told you it was me was right. It was indeed me. But please, forgive me. I'm sorry. If you're here to deal with me, go ahead and deal with me because I deserve no less for descending to such low. Please forgive me. I'm not a thief. I am not. I, I have never. Please, please, um, stop. What exactly are you talking about? You mean you don't know? <laughs> know what? Oh, um, please, forgive me, please. 
I, I will tell you this. I, I have a confession. Before meeting you and your sister four days ago, I I saw and picked a wallet with 64,000 naira inside of it. Oh yes. The truth is that even while you and your sister complained about a missing wallet with money in it, I still had the complete money with me. I am sorry about it, but I, I am not a thief. Understand me. I'm sorry. Please, forgive. Please. What? How dare you? I'm sorry. Please, Butu. Please, Biko. The truth is that telling you about it or returning the money to you that very day would mean sentencing someone so there to me to that. Please forgive me. Please. It was a case of good and evil placed in front of me to make a choice, which I, I selfishly chose evil because I needed to save a life. I'm so sorry, I'm not a thief. I am not. I have never tried it. Please forgive me. But honestly, if I'm placed under such circumstance again, I will still do it again and again and again. I'm sorry, I am not a thief. Please, forgive me, please. Please, you can do whatever thing you want to do to me. You can, you can do it. I am ready to face it. Please, I'm sorry. I needed to save a life. Please. After my National Youth Service program, I joined her in her restaurant business. I helped her modernize it. But when Mobi was attacked by Boko Haram terrorists, we ran out of the city, only to, to come back and meet our properties, our cars, our houses, the restaurant, including my school certificates, completely destroyed oh and burned. We had no other choice but to come back to the village. Six months ago, we resolved to come back to the village. We were trying to pick up our basics, trying to get something better to do when she came down with this sickness. Oh God. That is my story. The story of selfless sacrifices made by this woman to give life to the child of a dead stranger. And now that she is in need, I cannot even help her. I had to become a thief for me to pay for her trust. Um, listen. You don't have to say that. You are not a thief. I would okay. have... I would have returned your wallet the very day I picked it up. If I'm not a thief. You did what you did because of the circumstances you found yourself. Anyone in your shoes will do the same. I would even do worse. You are not a thief. Okay. Oh, I mean, you're forgiving me. Right there in the forest. I hold nothing against you. Okay? Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. I'll talk to my parents about your mother's case. I am not promising anything. I understand. Thank you so much. Thank you.
Enter the car. Hi, Buka. Mother, be good. Please, let me be. Not again, please. Let me be now. I say you should enter this car. I beg you in the name of God. As you can see, I am going home. I'm going home to wash my mother's dirty clothes so that I can go back to the hospital and be with her. The plan has changed. Changed by me. Enter the car. Mother my God, you know. You are talking to a human being. Hope you know that, right? A human who has lost his independence of thought and actions. You are more or less a slave, a goody slave. And a slave who wants to stay alive. Don't argue with his master. Enter the car. Is that a threat or what? Me? I am too big to threaten a low life like you. I'd rather mold you into shape if you dare me. Now, enter the car. Stop there! Are you entering this car or do I use this to write the last chapter of your miserable life? Some. Echo Dean has made a degree and so shall it be. Tell me who the lady my soul saw you with at the hospital. That is forced. Just four days ago, you were able to get the recommended drugs for Dora that would last her for two weeks. And when I ask you where you got the money, you didn't say anything today. An affluent, looking strange lady visited the hospital with you to see Dora. Who's she? That's too much a coincidence for a goodie to ignore. So tell me, who is she? I will never disclose her identity to a devious witch like you. Even at the point of that, you think that forcing me to your house at some point and locking me inside your toilet will force me to tell you what I vowed never to tell you? Better think again. You are wasting your time. By the way, she's not part of the bizarre deal you blackmailed me into having with you. Is she? Yes. She is. How? Well, she is beautiful, according to my sons, and I don't care if she's the one that gave you the money or not. My only concern is about what her sudden presence in the equation could mean for the bedroom deal I have with you. Oh, you are jealous, right? <laughs> And who are you laughing at? I'm laughing to you, Luda. I'm laughing to your miserable life. Hey, Goldie, even with locking me up inside your toilet, you are still a prisoner. A prisoner to your loss. Prisoner to your shame. Prisoner to your insecurity. You are an insecure animal in the prison of your own satanic flesh. Hey, Goldie, shame on you. 
Shame, shame on you, we do. Oh, Captain. Miserable prisoner to your own lust. My God, you are really miserable. And the worst is that having sex with you is like boxing the air. Because you are really empty. Oh, yes. And you have nothing to show for it. Your former customers in Yola and Italy are skewed and taking everything away from you. You have nothing left in you. What do you have to show for it? Loneliness. Crystal lust and frustration. Sorry for you, Egodi. I'm so, so sorry for you. No. Shoot me. Yes. I retired and frustrated. Old. I go a shower. Go ahead and shoot me. If only you knew how much you've compounded your situation by all that you've said to me. Only you knew. God, you're a loser. Nothing will happen to me. Go ahead and do whatever thing you want to do. What more will you do to me? What more will you do to me, Egodi? What more will you do to me other than detaining me in your house and having sex with me every night? What more will you do to me, Egodi? Other than spreading your old wrinkled laughs for seeing me like a dead animal to spread your leg and keep having sex with you harder and harder and harder again. What more will you do to me, Egoni? <sighs> See, tonight, you've lost it all. Oh, yes, because even the weakest of erections will not come from me. No matter how you force me, I am not ready for anything with you. Cry to bed, dry wood. You've lost the battle you started. We're forgetting something. We're forgetting someone. Dora. I admit everything you called me tonight. No problem. There's something I want you to also admit.
without you. Without you, sugar boy. Dora can never make it life out of that hospital. No. Who will stop me from going to her? Me. Where you are leaving this house, this room, is for you to be able to make up with me till they break without stopping. And if getting erection becomes an issue, Echo D has a lot of sex terror. Need I remind you that whenever you're here to make out with me, hefty young guys are out there waiting for my instruction to kill you. Just for me to say so. And that includes getting any form of violent treatment from you, dude. Now get those rags off your waist. Let's get started. What brought you here? From my pretty lips to your toy. Do you need help? after 9 a.m. in the morning already. They'll be looking for me at the hospital. I need to go. Please allow me to go. I've already done what you demanded of me last night, didn't I? You've done one. Remaining the other to be done. So, do the need for Else you're not leaving this house. Which other needful are you talking about? Huh? The girl that visited Dora at the hospital. Where is she from? Where did you meet her? Who is she to you? Like I said to you before, even on gunpoint, I will never tell a desperate devil like you who that girl is. Oh yes, if my mother dies as a result, sad, but I'm sure she will f forgive me when everything that happened will be revealed to her in the spirit world. I know she will forgive me. Really? <laughs> so you 
consider hiding her identity from me as what risking everything for than saving Dora's life. It's alright. The door is open. You can go. Read my lips. Do not say I didn't warn you. If anything happens to her, if she comes to violent end, don't blame me. But I... Shut up. Now dress up and leave my house. Get out! Get, 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 get out! The time is up. with you. We've been trying to reach you all day. Your phone has been switched off. Oh, no need explaining. My sister has explained everything that you're going through with your mother, my parents and I. We actually went to the hospital to see your mom. My oh. sister and them are parents. Oh, really? Yes. You went with your family to see my mother? Yes. Thank you. Um, why don't you come and say hi to them? I mean, when I told my dad and mom, they were actually really surprised yeah. and they decided that we all go to the hospital. That's my dad and my mother. Hey, Daddy, this is Ebuka, the son to the woman we went to see at the hospital now. Ebuka, this is, um, these are my parents. Good day, sir. How are you? I'm fine. Good day, ma. God bless you there. Thank you, ma. My daughters have been trying to reach you since morning after our morning devotion. What happened to your phone? Oh, sir. My phone was switched off. Okay. I had flat battery, sir. Okay. Sorry. I'm sorry about it. It's okay. Amarachi told us everything yesterday. And we have seen for ourselves after visiting the hospital, and we've also heard from the doctor, we have decided to sign off the medical bill. Oh, thank you so much, sir. Thank yes. you, sir. We'll, we'll pay for the drugs, thank you, sir. the surgery, and the after surgery medical care. Oh, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you so much. I really appreciate this. Thank you, sir. Thank you, Amarati. Thank you. It's Thank you. Okay, Thank fine. you. you don't have to Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. It's okay. Thank you. It's okay, man. Get up. Get up. Thank you. The human family is one that tries when they have reach out to help they have not. So it's alright. Thank you, ma. Thank you. Oh yes. 
We didn't do anything exceptional. We had the means, and so we decided to help. In fact, God expects all humans to do the same to one another. Okay, sir. Thank you. My God will bless you all. My God will favor you all. My Amarachi. God will bless you. Can you just stop thanking me? I told you, it's nothing. My God will bless you. It's fine. Okay? Thank you so much, sir. I really appreciate this. I really appreciate this. My God will favor you all. This is... Hi. Come on. Hi. Thank you, thank you, thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. In thank case you. you need anything to purchase, you can use this. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you so much, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank I'm you, talking sir. about um, writing of your mother's medical bill. Yes, the check. Hey! Hey! We're on our way to the bank to withdraw and pay the doctor as demanded. But now that you are here, you can go and cash it and pay him yourself. Hey! Thank you so much, sir. Thank you. Thank you, Amarachi. Thank you. Thank you. It's okay. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, no, 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 no. Ebuka, Ebuka, please, 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 please. Just stand up. You shouldn't have done this. I told you it's not the end. It's fine, okay? It's okay. Ebuka, Ebuka, no, 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 no. This is not right. No. Please, please. I, be I beg you, just stand up. It's okay. It's fine. Thank you. Ebuka, you don't have to do that. Thank you. Okay? Thank you. Thank you, Dad. Thank you. My whole life is changing. Good morning. Yes, I'm in my house. I'm washing my mother's dirty clothes that she used previously. I'll be there soon. Any, any problem? What? Doctor, tell me you're pulling my legs, right? Tell me you're pulling my legs. That my mother is out of coma? Are you for real, doctor? Are you for real? Oh my god, oh my god. Yes, yes, I'll be there soon, I'll be there soon. Uh, just a few minutes, few minutes, I'll be there. Thank you. Hey! Oh my God. Hey! Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Thank you. I am grateful. I'm grateful. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for coming back to life. I love you so much, Mom. I love you. I love you. Abuka. Mom? You still called me mom after everything. After yeah. hearing everything. Yes, Mom. Whatever that which revealed to me has done no damage to who you are and mean to me. Oh, yes. You are my mother. My one and only mother. Nothing will change that in my heart. Not even a million ago these. Thank you. Thank you, Ibuka. 
Thank you for not abandoning me after hearing everything. The doctor told me everything you have been doing. Thank you and God bless you for me. Amen, Mom. God bless you too for all you did for me. You saved my life as a baby. You raised me up as your own flesh and blood. There is no Ebuka without you. You denied yourself comfort and this life for my sake. God bless you so much. God bless you, my son. Mm -hmm. Even if I don't survive this, hearing you say this, I would die a fulfilled woman. You're not going to die, mother. You will not die. God has said an emphatic no to it. You're not going to die. God has sent some angels in the form of a kind family from Acha community. Yes. Uh, Ebuka, that reminds me. The Dr. Steve told me that a family from Acha came earlier today to visit and that they promised to pay my bills. Who are they? What are they? The, the, the doctor wants to see you immediately. Okay. In his office. Okay, nice. Mom, let me see him. I'll tell you everything about them when I come back, right? Yes, sir. The good Lord has answered us. I'll be back soon. Let me see the doctor. Let's go. Oh. Ebuka. Mom, do not worry. I'm still the Ebuka that you saved and raised up. You named me Chukwe Ebuka. God is great. Mother, God is indeed great. I'll be back soon. Please God, preserve Chukwe Buka, my son, for me. Bless him and protect him for me. Thank you, God. Chukwe Buka. Yeah. Who is that? Come in. Oh, doctor. Hey, yes, I, I actually did. But I was just informed that uh, there is a new patient needing my attention. However, since you're, you're here, I will spare you one minute to tell you why I called you. Okay. Before the intensive care equipment we hired got here, your mom came out of coma. Yeah. We still need them though, hence we'll have to keep them handy. Okay. Uh, actually, I sent for you so I could uh, confirm if you've gotten everything needed for the surgery tomorrow, as you promised me earlier. You mean the the fonts required? Sure, sure, the fonts. I I need to be sure before asking the surgeons to come down here tomorrow. You said the chief who was here earlier with his wife gave you a check covering the men. Have you cashed it? Not yet, Doctor. I was about going to Okiwe to cash the check when I got a call that my mother has come out of coma requesting to see me. So I had to come here first. But I'll soon go there and cash it. Yeah, that's okay. But you see, the money has to be paid in full else who will not commence preparations for the surgery. Mm -hmm. Doctor, I must pay the money. I, yeah, I have the check already. I'll just have to go to Okiwe. Okiwe is close by. Don't worry, I'll get the money. Once the accountant confirms the full payment, uh, preparations for the surgery will uh, commence immediately. Thank you, Doctor. I'll, I'll rush, I'll get it. It's okay, we'll okay. Thank you. Hello, nurse. Anything new to report? That Evoca told you people that he will not be going to the bank to cash the check. Why? Oh, that it will pass the banking hour before he gets the bank in Okiwe. 
one minute. Yeah, he's right. And when did he say he would be going to do that? First thing tomorrow? It's all right, Ness. Thanks for the head up. No. I've not gotten any information about who the girl is or any member of her family, where they're staying, and how they met Elbuka. But there's someone on it for me. As soon as the person gets to know anything about them or if he makes any physical contact with them, the person going after that will pick it up from there and let me know. It's all right. Thank you very much. Yeah, hello, Sergeant Toby. Yes, you need to stand down. He's not going to the bank again. First thing tomorrow morning. It's all right. Okay. Of course. Bye. Till then. <laughs> Well, only the Almighty knows that any time their family is tracked, I'll just send Sergeant Obi and his crew to wipe them off the surface of Earth. They signed their death warrants the day they got themselves involved in Dora's case. I don't know how they made Eboka or the reason, but they are done for doom. Booker is in my cell's trap. And I am not going to let him go easy. It's either he ties of sex, steroid, overdose, or I get tired of him and push him off. And that should be when he's down and never to perform again, you know. It's not my fault. This is a good life. <laughs> oh my word, when you got the money, you got the whole world. Officer, what is it again? You under arrest for raping Madame Ekode and making away with her money and valuables. Officer, please, please, don't do this, please. I beg you in the name of God. I am on my knees. Please don't do this. Please, please. As you can see, the water and the food. I'm taking it to the hospital for my tired mother. She needs it before she could take her drugs. Please, don't do this. I am not available. I am not ready for this game. Please. Shut up your mouth. Who is playing girl with you? What more do I call it? When an adult like you, who knows the truth about what you said you came to arrest me for, still comes to do it. Don't you have conscience? Don't you have conscience? Utter another word and shoot you in the head. Maya, move! This way! I said move! Before I shoot in the head. This way! Keep going! Officer, officer, I don't want this. I said move! I, I, I don't like this, officer. 
stop now, please. Stop. Full oh, stop, officer. Stop. Have you picked the water can and the food flask where he left them during the arrest? Okay. Now you have to take them to Dora at the hospital with the cover story I briefed you earlier before now. You know what to do. All right then. Bye. Please, 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 don't shoot me, please. <laughs> uh, please, please, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, please, please, uh, I should go down, okay, okay, sorry, sorry, please, please, forgive me, please, I'm sorry, please, please, have mercy, please, please. Hello, handsome. <laughs> Madam Egodi. Officer Obi. What is going on here? Welcome to our bottom match tonight. This is about your bestial madness. Why did you waste your strength in this police officer's arrest stunt when you have everything you need to blackmail me into compliance as you always do? Well, I wanted a change of style and don't waste your time asking me why. Oh, but really? Mm -hmm. Very well then, go ahead and do your worst, because I am not ready for this madness tonight. Do your worst, shoot me. I said shoot me. Shoot me. Oh, hey, shoot me. Hey. Number one, I need to go here. I'm on phone, I'm off. Mm-hmm. Here is better. Look at you. You've already worsened your sorry situation by this silly art you just put up here. And one more art of defiance from you. I will use what I have against you to make sure I destroy you for real. You see this mock arrest this night? Will turn out to be a real arrest for rape. And armed robbery. Madame Egode, I am not a criminal. And I did not rape you. I did not. I did not. I have clear evidence that you did. Do you have any evidence that you didn't? Do you? Madam Egodi, I have none. And I also do not have slavish police officers like you have. But I have God. I have God. I serve a living God. And for that alone, this cruel game that you started will end with your disgrace. This cruel game that you started with an innocent soul like me. I did nothing to you. 
you will end in disgrace. My God will disgrace you. I am very sure of it. My God will disgrace you. Your end is near. Mother be good. Are you done talking nonsense? If you are, then let's get started for the reason why you were brought here. Oh? Are you damning the consequences and opting out our deal? Is a question. I opted into this madness because of my sick mother. But for her sake, I'm still in. Smart boy. Smart dude. Officer? Come. This. Your fee for tonight's operation. You can leave. Tell my men to stand by. My friend, what are you waiting for? Go bed, let's get this started in a kirigare. Something I know you enjoy doing. Come on, set me on fire. Surgery is now useless for me. 
Was that the reason you gave my food and water to the nurse last night to bring to me and told her to tell me that you went to the church to hold a prayer for me? Chukwebuka, answer me. Am I going to die? Did the doctor say I am going to die? Chukwebuka, what? Chukwebuka! Chukwebuka! Am I going to die? Chief, after hearing from my mother at the hospital, my first instinct was to confront the nurse and beat her to truth about who boggled my house and destroyed the check that you gave to me from her. But on a second thought, I realized that she is a member of a goodies gang and as such, any isolated action against her will compound my woes rather than help. Chief, please, I want you to know that I am not here for another check because my mother still has about two weeks to be okay without the surgery. I am here, Chief, because I need your help. I really need your help, Chief. With the extent that I may go the has gone about this, my mother and I are in danger. We are not safe, Chief. I want you to help me and stop her, please. I don't care if I don't care if she sends me to jail with the evidence she has against me. But I want this madness to stop. Please. My innocent mother deserves to leave. She deserves no less, Chief. Help me and stop her. Help me and stop her, please. Chine Amarachi Lolo. I want you people to help me. Please. Please help me and talk to Madame Godi to stop stopping our lives. Please. Chief, please help me. I want her to stop. I want her to stop, please. It's okay. Hey, Buka, please rise. And sit here, sit, sit. You see, Ebuka, you did the right thing by not confronting the nurse or the ego the lady. And by choosing to come here to seek for help, I don't need any begging from you to do something like this. No, I don't need it. Chief, all I want, I want her to stop. Please, help me and call her. Help me and call her. Help me and tell her to stop. She should stop. I don't want my mother to die. I don't want that innocent woman to die. She deserves to live. Hello. Yes, Barista of God. There's something I'll need your urgent legal advice on. Yes. Immediately. I'm at home. Gentlemen, there's a new development as we projected last night when we planned to force Eboka and brought him here to sleep in my house. So that you guys can boggle the house, search for the check and destroy it. Guess what? This morning, he went to the chief's house for another check. Great. <laughs> yes, he didn't just meet him in any other place. He met him right there in his hometown, his family house in Acha community. Unknown to him, Someone I paid followed him up to there and took notice of the house address, which I will forward to you. Now listen very carefully. The man's name is Chief Ekekwe. 
he lives in the compound with his wife and two daughters. You will go there tonight. Pose as armed robbers as we've planned it and make sure that no soul in that family survives after your visit. Your fee for this operation is one million naira each. Yes. I will transfer 500,000 naira to your accounts as soon as we are done talking. The remaining half a million will be transferred to your account when you have successfully completed the hit. Am I understood? Consider the whole family dead, madam. Mm. <laughs> yes, you're right. They signed their death warrant when they get crashed into my space by involving themselves with Eboka. My sex toy. Or do I call him my sex slave? <laughs> oh, dear. Very good. How dare you? How dare you send these hungry slaves, these thieves in police uniform, to break into my home and destroy the check Chief Ekekwe gave to me for my sick mother? How dare you? Hmm, a book. Why are you arriving here so late? I had expected you here earlier before now or at the police station. Why did it take you so long to find out that we were behind it? Are you that daft? Are you? Maybe he was too shocked to think straight and piece it together after seeing the Don Shek back at home. And when he did realize it was part of his fake arrest hunt, Last night, he became too confused to make up his mind to react till now. <laughs> oh, sugar boy. And now that you have pieced it together, how may we help you? I mean, why are you here? How dare you? How dare you? Shut up! Any wrong move will strangle you here now. Tell him, officer. Tell the fool. Need I remind you that the sperm I extracted from my vagina the very first day, these gentlemen, officers, and I blackmailed you into sleeping with me in this house. He still were preserved in a clinic at Okiwe. to escape serving a long term of prison you better not dare with me you better don't dare me because I can easily with the evidence arrest you for rape and armed robbery and you know what that means it is as easy as ABC, boy. Don't. Don't you dare me. And if I dare you, what will happen? Well, I will tell those officers here to kill you and dispose your fucking body in my cell's pit. Now get out. Don't get me started. On the count of ten, I want you out of this house or I will order them to kill you. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. Seven, 
Your area is surrounded by my men. If you do any funny move here, I'll finish you. <laughs> You're shocked, right? You're shocked. I told you. Madam Egoldi, you are in a bigger mess as we speak. Because whatever nonsense you were discussing with this dirty man has been a record to the force has overlaid. Stop it. I placed a call to the DPU of Force Headquarters. He is aware and I have been here recording whatever nonsense you were discussing with them. So we have all the evidence to nail you down. I told you, right? Who is the winner now? <laughs> now you tell me. Which of the police division did you come here from? Another question from you, I will answer you with a bullet in your head. Did you hear that? I told you. <laughs> I told you I will have the last laugh, right? It's time to nail you. It's time to bring you down. The DPU is aware of everything that you guys are, we are discussing. Let's get out of here. Officer, pull them out. Yeah, break out. 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 Deal with her well. You've seen your life, right? Huh? I told you. Mm. <laughs> Out! <laughs> oh, Ebuka. If only you knew the whole story. You won't be laughing like a drunken fool. Madame Egode. There is no other side to the story other than the fact that you are in chains of justice and are exonerated and free like a bear. <laughs> <laughs> oh, say so school, dude. Ebuka. Well, need I remind you that the food can and the water you left behind where you were arrested yesterday was picked by this nurse and was taken to Dora the hospital. It was laced with high potent poison that should have started working on her body right about now. So if only you can close your lousy mouth and rush to the hospital, I believe you can watch your so-called Dora dying. Tell me this is not true, right? Of course it is. No. <laughs> I won! Take me! <laughs> I won! Oh my word! Come on! Bring it on! Bring it on! I won the game! Can you talk to me? 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 Can you tal
Can you please talk to me? Talk to eh? me now. Well, yes, yes. Uh, now. Yes, what is going on? You're a man, right? Yes, yes. I should be able to contain whatever happens. Yes. She's dead. Why, mother? Why? Why didn't you stop them? Why didn't you stop them? Why didn't you stop them, mother? Why? She vowed to do everything possible to help me locate your people. Why didn't you stop them? Why did you allow them Take her away from me. She treated me so well. She was my happiness. Why, mother? You're my biological mother. Why did you stop them from killing her? Why? Why? I don't get it. Ebuka. Do you mean Auntie Dora? Is not your biological mother. Yes. She's not my biological mother. She's my adopted mother. When I found out late, my adopted mother was already in the hospital, sick and down. <laughs> the, the picture is the only evidence I have. My adopted mother said that she could, she could not even trace her. She does not even know her whereabouts or where she came from. Barrister Goji, please come. You need to see this. Yes. Yes, if and I. Do you know her? Goodness. My adopted mother said her name is Ifonaya. Even Madame Eldodi confirmed it. Do you know her, please? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my dad. Oh my god. He's my son. Yes. Hey. Oh my god. My goodness. My goodness, you are my son. Yes, what? he's my son. Yes. Hey, Emuka. You, he's my son. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> he's my son. Yes. No, no. He's my son. Yes. You're my son. Hey, hey. If not, oh, if not, you lived to deliver our baby. Yes. <laughs> he's my son. He's my son! He's my son! He's my son! He's my son!
imole iji gbele gbele ademi lori mi o imole ngi na so eti jayo gedero imole iji gbele gbele ademi lori mi o imole ngi na so eti jayo gedero imole iji gbele gbele ademi lori mi o Himale na so eti jari o gedero Himale iji gbele gbele ademi lori mi o Himale na so eti jari o gedero Darkness and power, like you instructed. I have eaten and drunk nothing but my feces and urine for fourteen days and fourteen nights. I have also slaughtered seven vultures and seven tortoises and baited you with their combined blood, like you requested. You, who is the custodian of Igubolimori? The ultimate power to harm and to control. I stand before you right now, fully prepared to receive that charm, that great charm. Give me Ubori Mori and I will serve you and your interests forever, all the days of my life. Give me Ubori Mori. Give me Ubori Mori. Give me Ubori Mori. I have a Ubori Mori. You me? I for me, I for me, I for me, I for Baba mi ari bamba ele ba le gori odo e pado ni jani gorofo ene mo lomo ni petiye ele mi ni le fe jewe oni ni kokun kokun lorun kini ari ja ejo kini ari ja ejo o mo ni le teji teji hey ba so mi so mo ju ba yin o i to ba le mi re mo du pa lawo yin o hey mo du pa o se o mo to pa da o e se o I show, I show, I am not wrong. What about the one? He must learn how to show. That is a yoga zero. He must learn how to show. Oh, so she's pretty great. My trip to Abuja was awesome. I know. <laughs> I have filed all the documents for the for implementation. <laughs> and of course, uh, like I said, my trip to Abuja was awesome. <laughs> I experienced a lot, <laughs> but that's by the way. Uh -huh. Yes, um, what do you intend to do with that property at um, Muhammad uh, uh, Street? Yeah, I intend to build uh, an administrative block for my company. My oh, company. I thought that was what I saw it coming there. <laughs> Barrister. <laughs> I know, you know, when we were back in the school, I used to call you Barrister. <laughs> Well, see how life turns around. And I knew you were going for the top. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> you can say that again. <laughs> we will celebrate soon. Yes. I know you are going to do something wonderful there. Yes. Oh yes, that like I have Oh. Bon appétit. Merci. Ce n'est pas un problème, je suis pas fou. As usual. As Who is that? 
Family is uh, more than exceptional. With, with a pretty wife like the one you have, and uh, absolutely gorgeous and pretty daughters, and the kind of food I had a while ago to complement it day after day. Abrumi, along the girl, God has blessed you. He has done great for you. Eh? See that food? You want to have it a, a, a while ago? Ah! All my life, I've never had such, such food. What we eat in the Jebude is uh, Inyo, Epa, Amola. And it's Amola, not even the white one, the black Amola. Uh, whoa. Whoa. Um, uh, issue at a Wedu or Befa. We have, I, have, I have never eaten this kind of food before all my life. Eh? Oh, Oguchi, eh? my brother, eh? you will never change. Ha, Sendike. Always with the right words to praise and admire. I cannot change, Sendike. You know, Mili Senji, I cannot change at all. The words are coming naturally in this case. With the kind of food, that your family give to me to eat and the kind of treatment after the reception the warm reception i got from them ah it is enough to make any person a, a, a professional praise singer as well as an orator i'm going here the truth yeah. is this i run my family in a particular way i can see my wife and my daughters yeah. See you as no different from me. Ah, oh no, I will oh, bless them. <laughs> but I'm glad that you like the food. Ah, like it. Like it, look, me. More love for it. Oh, you come in. All right, let us toast. Love. 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 Love.
long life. I'm you. I'm more progress. I'm you. I'm you. Ah. Um. Hello, good. Where are you? Very strong. If we don't have long, we are going to leave you. We don't have this type uh, uh, in the body. Don't worry, I have enough. You will enjoy it. No, no. Hey, I brought me. What, JD? Yes, I understand your argument. When you say you want to move over to our parents' end, uh, yes, to yes, stay yes. there between now and next week when you return to it, your body. Uh, Benny, Benny. Um, but what I don't get is why you are in a hurry to do that. You have a beautiful and well furnished place here. Why don't you relax while we get that place cleaned up? I know you are the first son, and uh, it is your house. You are entitled to stay there. Yeah. Eh? But just be patient. Let's clean it up so that uh, you can move. Uh, Brumi, or uh, uh, I understand you. Uh, but it is only somebody that can see the innermost part of my heart that can understand how much I have missed our uh, parents' house and uh, how guilty I feel staying away from this village for so long a time. Please, allow me to uh, start making up for my feelings by moving uh, into our parents' house now. Please, I, I don't even mind if I have to sleep on a heap of dust this night. Uh, I don't mind at all. Uh, uh, meanwhile, uh, Ushi, thank you for renovating the house for me. God will bless you. Along the Batyeje, God will not spoil your own. He will do your right too. You are welcome. Yeah, sure. But like I was saying, yeah. my son Henry yeah. will be returning from America tomorrow. Luto, where he, uh, he went to acquire a higher degree. Oh, oh, oh the graduation. Yes. Hey, yeah. oh the graduation. Yeah. Hey, yeah, you know that. That and one is good. And my wife yeah. and daughters will be going to. Enugu to pick him up from the airport. Oh, you hear me? You hear me? I understand. I would like to discuss something very serious with you when I come back. Uh. You see, I would like to set up a viable business for you. Business? Yes. I don't mind where you do it, in Jebode or anywhere of your choice. I want to stay in Jebode. But I just want a situation where you can remarry and have children of your own. You no, just make up your mind what you want, where you want it done, and it is done. Approve me. Edge go approve me. What should it? Let me just give you an answer straight now. I don't want to keep it waiting. Uh, uh, about the location, I want to go back to Jabodi. That is where people have known me and I have known people. So I want to go back to Jabodi. Uh, it's okay. Yes. I have gotten friends there. Uh, about the business, uh, I want to uh, start selling uh, emu fufu. Eh? What? Emu fufu, yeah, pan wine. Uh, at the uh, Agbo, Agbo Lotin, at the Baraga, at the Bushmeat, and all that. I'll come back with you. I'll tag on, oh, ah, he sells very well. My plan was to set up a multi-million naira supermarket. Ah, what you? Me feel? Hmm. My dear love, me feel. Da 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 da. Kilinge, kilinge, me mota, me le, me le, me le dashi. For all, for all, for all. Yes, Sophie. Let me tell you something. Say the between belong where I live at the body. I want more do good job. I want labour They are there. All this, all this, I want halotti. I don't want to go. Prostitute. Hold on, hold on. If I live in one way, they stay close to my house. And uh, Tomati lost his shoes. When they finish doing their um, nonsense up and down, they will just come to the shop. What that day? Turn here. So he says so. A lot of people doing it are making a hell of money. It's a good business, so. The litigation, the spirit of your late parents, 
brought against you before the grandmasters of the realm has been decided. Your parents were quite angry and demanded your instant death. It took a passionate plea from me to the grandmasters to make them honor your parents to drop that demand and come up with another. What they come up with was that both of us be stripped of the power to harm your brother and all the members of his family in any way. Again, I pleaded against it because what you went through to possess me. Being the most trusted element, the grandmasters ruled in the middle. By so doing, they give two options to choose from. You are to choose between harming your brother and his wife only or harming only their children. You cannot harm both sides. The grandmasters of the realm said emphatic no to that. Ah, no. That is not acceptable to me at all. Eh? Igobolimori. How? How can the grandmasters of the realm give such verdict? Eh? You know I did all I did to possess you just for one reason, and that is to eliminate Ekegwe and his wife so that their wealth can be mine. How can that be possible if I if, if I cannot eliminate them? Make your choice now. Kilewi, I should make my choice. Ha. Ah. Okay. But he you that do, he lay you ten long road. Shuala, um, uh, I, I choose Ekekwa and his wife. Uh, I choose them. So that by the time they are out of the way, I can now devise a means of uh, eliminating his children and still achieve my aim. You can only manipulate them after that. Any attempt to harm them, physically or spiritually, will backfire on you with serious consequences. Not even me or any power in this universe can save you from the impending calamity. Hello, you got you. Hey, you don't leave for me. Uh, I miss you, Harry. I miss you so, so much. See, let me tell you something. When I see you at the airport tomorrow, I am going to give you an exceptional hug that the papers are going to have our pictures on their pages the next day. <laughs> yes, both of us. Mm. See, Amarachi and I will so do with that. You, mom or dad will have to call the airport police to help you. Right. <laughs> <laughs> see, there won't be any need for that, you girls. See, upon seeing you guys tomorrow, I'm going to carry you both on my shoulder, like I'll hook you here, I'll hook you up from the arrival lounge to the car park. See, you won't believe how much I've been going to gym for you girls. See, let me tell you. <laughs> I seen this. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. Okay. Enough said, sir. Mm. The fact is that we all miss you indeed. Mm -hmm. Let's give you the chance to tidy up your parking and proceed to the airport so that you don't miss your flight. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. You need it, son. Mm. You know mommy loves you, right? Wow, mommy, I love you. Daddy, I love you. I love you. Babes, I love you girls. I can't wait to see you. We love you mm. so much. I love you. See you soon. I love you more. Nobody loves you like I do. Oh. <laughs> Bye-bye. Um, hello, Amarachi. Hope the drugs you took is effective. How many times have you visited the toilet since your dad and I left the house? Once. Are you sure? Mm. That's a good sign. It's been two hours we left the house. 
It's okay, my angel. You're going to be okay, all right? Daddy and mommy love you very much. You know that. Yes, I know. I know you do. Okay, please, can you pass the phone to your sister? Hello, mommy's angel. How strong is Amarachi looking? Okay, thank God. Thank God. <sighs> Has your uncle come to have his afternoon meal? Oh, he hasn't. That means he's still doing his house clean up at his end. Oh, when you wait for half an hour and he doesn't come, please pass a call to him. Find out what he wants to eat. Prepare it and take it to your grandpa's end. Okay? He mustn't be left hungry. Please. I trust you, my baby. I know you'll do it for me. Yes, we are already in Enugu. We're just entering Enugu. We're still at the outskirts of Enugu. Yes. Okay, baby. Love you, my darling. Please do take care, okay? Bye. Now, tell me. Is Amarachi okay? Yes, she's getting better. Huh? I feel for her. I feel for all of them. After all the plans they have made for their reunion, sudden stomach upset ruined everything for her and for them. If only you people knew that I struck Amarachi with running stomach in order to prevent the girls from joining you in the car to Enugu. If only you people knew that I did it so that I can do this. Happy boy and love you now. Goodbye. Hello, Kudano. Hello, Marani. Igubo Rimori. Enya Jaile. Aja Ode. Aja Ijebu Ile. Ati Aja Ijebu Ode. Ati Ijebu Ibo. Muki Gbogbo Nyi Lo Kone Lo Bini. Eko Ajo Mi. Mutu Kwa Lo Wanyi. Henry, as soon as Henry gets to the arrival launch at the airport in Enugu, strike him with serious urge to urinate. And as soon as he enters the restroom, grab and hold him hostage in the trunk of a tree in the jungle. Hold him there for the rest of his life. Put a call through to his sisters. Tell them that you are a hired assassin paid by a lady he robbed when he was still in Nigeria. Let them hear gunshots and tell them that you just killed Henry and that they should not bother looking for his corpse because they will not find it. I shot a new logo. A brand Latin Yolonero. A good Latin Bolobo Lero. Mokini, Eshim, Eshim, Eshim. 
Yes, I am Barrister Obodji. It's okay. Uh, uh, yes, officer. Uh, I am his friend and his uh, lawyer. Uh, yes, I'm actually in his house. Well, as a matter of fact, we've been trying to reach him and his wife for about two hours now without success. My dad. But uh, yes, if, if, if you're with him, let me speak with him. Yes. What are they saying? What? what? Officer! Hello? Please, please, can I talk to, to him? He, he's my father. Yes, yes. Yes, I am the daughter. Wait, wait, wait. We want to talk to daddy. Wait, wait, let me confirm. What? What? My goodness. What did you say? Great love. So, see me. Talk to me. What is it? Oh, it's okay. What she wants? What she wants? No! Marchi! Kilosaw, what is it? What is it? Baba wari bamba wale ba le gori odo pado ni ja ni korofo ona mo lo mo ni petiye olomi ni le o fe je we oni le kogun kogun loro kini aguguri ja eju omo adele teji teji mo so mi so e mo so mi so e ya lagbara Hey, any yam you should Baba, me a ribamba. Thank you for the progress made so far. After the death of Ekekwe and his wife, I did a lot of things in my village that puts the fear of me in everybody's life. With the power of Ugo Limori, I invoked bees to sting and scatter Omoada. When they were having confrontation with Chinenye, few days after the burial of my brother and his wife. With that, the fear of me became the beginning of wisdom in Acha land. I will keep being grateful. It is true that the girls got their own bits of this thing from the bees. Uh, but I later reconciled with them and made them believe and trust me one more time. Now, time to go full-blown 
with the implementation of why I embarked on this war against my own. Baba, me a ribamba, mo du balo wo ni o mo kini ni ya mi o shurunga. Mo ti bagbo ye mo njemi. Eh, jago ju ti mi. Eh, jago ju ti mi. Eh, jago ta yo mi mo du balo wo ni. Eh, jago ta si mireni. Ah, talo joni it was send was send the body to that bini. Chinaya. From this moment, you become my partner in crime. You become my partner in every atrocity I commit in my family. You have no right to say no or object to it or whatever I do to Amarachi. You must always say yes. You must always talk in affirmative. No matter how much she cries, no matter how much she displays anguish and agony, it will never touch you. I put stone heart in you. Let your heart be hardened, more than rock, against uh, uh, Amarachi. Yes, I lock you up in the prison of my mind forever. Baba <laughs> What is it? Why, why were you screaming? Are you okay? I don't know. What do you mean you don't know? You were screaming like you were going to bring that. Leave me, Marachi. I don't know what happened to me. All of a sudden, it felt like my head was set on fire. And then suddenly, it stopped. It's okay, All right? It's all right. I'm scared. And I'm scared too. Not to worry, everything will be fine, okay? Uh, 
Okay. What's going on here? Good afternoon. Good afternoon, my dear. Um, Boni. Um, sorry, Uncle. I should have um, greeted you. I'm, I'm just surprised. You, you know, you left the village two days ago, and you told Chine and I that um, you would kill those day. Killing people jump because of me. Uh, what, what's all this uh, jump question you're asking me? Let us talk when we get inside. For now, I need the help of the two of you to carry my luggage into my room. Um, Cherubado, wait. Uh, sorry, I I need to understand what is going on. Did, did I hear you say your room? Amarachi, you heard him right. He said he wants us to talk when we get inside. Oh, yeah, get the other bag. Oh, oh yeah, Milenu. bedroom key. What's happening? What what do you want to use the keys for? To open it and move in. <laughs> so the year. <laughs> so the year. Did, did I hear you correctly? Move into dad and mom's bedroom. Okay. I'll I'll take this as a joke. Eh? This is a joke, right? Joki. Joki look good. Joki go. I joke any. My dear, nobody is joking here at all. Eh? You haven't told her. Oh, this is a good name. Um, told me what? If you are lost, find yourself. With the death of Henry, mom and dad, everything our parents' heart has become Uncle Ogochi's own. No, I kill. And, and, and that is because he is dad's elder brother and the only surviving male child of this family. Which means he has automatically inherited everything. And that includes mom and dad's bedroom. Even you and I. Oh, oh, Nikulewe. You will not die young. Chinege, uh, I thought it was. Uh, Monoto, no they go. Eh? You see, if you have any 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 further question or any explanation you demand, it will be supplied to you in due course. For now, I have something very important to do inside this room and it cannot be, be delayed any further. So let me hear. Man is up more. were buried and you were already laying claims to your properties including your matrimonial bedroom this is not right Chine, you need to listen to me mourning our parents doesn't just end with wearing these and crying every day without respect to the memories of those people we are mourning mourning is nothing but hey. My beauty in the sun. Will you marry me? Jesus!
please do! Can you just stop this? What in God's name is going on here? I need to be possessed by some spirit of madness or something. Oh, my children. Jane, listen to me. I beg you, listen to me. I don't know what this man has given to you. I don't know what is wrong. But whatever you are trying to do now is totally wrong. The man standing here is your uncle for goodness sake. Oh. You can't have anything to do with him. I am not her uncle. I may be your uncle, but not her. Um, what is that supposed to mean? Amma, all this of only, you've not told her. Tell me what, what is going on? Tell her. Amarachi, I am not your biological sister. Well, Tony, that's true. Well, your late parents adopted me. And right now, I am about to become your <laughs> uncle's wife. And your stepmother. Meaning that I'm going to be the madame of this mansion. So why don't you stop by saying a hearty congratulations to your stepmother? Shut up. Oh, you shut up and listen. Listen to me. I know what I'm saying. This is a joke, right? Listen. This is certainly a joke. I beg you, listen to me and listen good. This man is your uncle and you are my sister. Something wrong with me. Eh? Something wrong with me. You want to control the insurance? You want to control the air? My beauty is up. Give me a sister. Sister, let me Christ! What is wrong? What happened? Talk to me, talk to me, what happened? Oh, oh, oh. Who made you is so? Is it true? Uncle, please, I, I just want to know the truth. Is it true? It's what true? <laughs> Is it true that Chinaya, my younger sister, is not my biological sister? Who told you that? Chinaya did, Uncle. <laughs> uncle, Uncle Chinaya, and Chinaya said the same thing a while ago. I just want to know the truth. What is going on? Oguchi. <laughs> he left for his workplace at the cocoa plantation in uh, Ijabode two days ago, saying that the owners asked him to resume work immediately, else he will be sacked. He is bad. He is back and instead of moving to my grandparents' house, he moved into my father's house, claiming the house as his. He is claiming everything my father left behind. Uncle Biku, what is going on? I want to understand what is happening. Oh, Aguchi. Huh? Aguchi. That is too early now. That is not what we are talking about now. Yes. I just want to know what they are saying. Is it true? Uncle Pico, tell me they lied to me. Tell me they're joking. Pico, please. What you sow is what you reap. No matter how the rain falls, the sun will surely shine. No. I said stop. 
I acknowledge the fact that you are the, the, the head of our extended family. I respect that. I also demand that you respect the fact that you are standing in my compound. And as such, I demand you accord me some level of respect. This is not your compound. This is my father's compound. Abarachi, mind your language. You are talking to my husband. Now, who is this frustrated cow? You, you ungrateful slave. Just keep your mouth shut. Shut up. What did you just call me now? You heard me correctly. An ungrateful slave. If not that, I am not wearing anything inside. Oh. I'm Arachi. Well, that is because I just finished riding my <laughs> dear husband. Ah, ah you two. Yeah, you two. If not for it, I would have so beaten you that you would be begging for your life. Uh, I would have given it to you in a way that. Oh, Amarachi, you will regret ever knowing me. What punish you? Punish you? What 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 Go. Yes. Uh, do you bring me here to watch you quarrel and fight? Oh, Alexia, whatever it is you came here for, it's over. It's just over now. Leave this compound with her right now, and she must apologize to my wife for the insult she just directed at her. If not, she should consider herself a homeless girl. Oguchi, are you out of your mind? By inheriting her parents' assets, you have automatically inherited her. And her responsibilities. That's what happened. The same tradition allows me to disinherit her by publicly touching the ground with my scrotal sack. And I will do just that because my Akbamu is ready to do the needful right now. You will not do such wickedness. You will not do such wickedness. While I am still alive as the head. Of this extended family. But you. you will not die. Alozi, chill it, chill it. Do no, do no, do no, do no. Alozi, are you threatening me? In the name of are you threatening me? Mwa. Is your boy ready to me? Eh? Is what you are threatening? Let me tell you something. Alozi, I came back from your boy very prepared for anything. I came back with evil. I also came back with good. I want to be my friend and enjoy the good that I came back with. Take side with this loud standing beside you against me and you will have a clash of the evil that I return with. Make your choice. I'm not threatening. I don't see it. I don't see it. If you ever make up your mind to stare the devil in the face, Make sure you don't blink first. You have not forgotten what I did to Umwanda right here in this compound two weeks ago. Have you? I am going in right now. By the time I come back and still meet the two of you standing here, she will live with hunchback. And you, you will live with 20 liters size of elephant charges of the scrotum. Ibi. Eh? Iba, yes. And if you think you are man enough, Stand here till I come back. Uh, Abushi, please, please. Just don't worry. I, I am not here for that again. Please, I'm not. Ah, no. Never you call me again to have any interference between you and Oguchi. I cannot be part of it any longer. No, come back. Uh, I don't don't ever call me. I know the man. Uncle, what are you doing? It is a lot. Yeah. Frustrated being. Follow him. So yeah. Follow him. Oh, and Follow him. Oh. <laughs> look at her. Look, 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 look I love you. I love you. 
nonsense. Honey, Allô, Dieu. Le, 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 look at her. <laughs> if I sign you, honor him. Frustrated be. Nonsense. And you, Allô, Dieu. Huh. Don't try this place again, no. Oh. You know, we did uh, not finish uh, it. Yes. I was just in round three. <laughs> Yeah. Right now. Oh. Let's enter gear four. Yeah, 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 I'm a rat, sir. I'm a rat, Why are you staying here in a cold hammer time night like this? What happened to you? Where, where is Chine? Oh, okay, okay, it's okay, it's okay. Um, this is the key to the house. Please unlock it, right? You can't be staying out here. It is quite cold, right? Go inside where I put on the generator. Take, take, take. You will tell me everything inside, won't you? That's okay. Quickly, move. Move, let me on to the radio. I followed him all the way to his house, begging and crying to him. Uncle Alonso did not even as much utter a word to me. When we got to his house, he went inside and locked his door. As if following his examples, the leaders and elders of Acha community refused to help me. They were all afraid of Uncle Oguchi. Nobody would even listen to me. It did not just stop there. They all stood and watched my uncle beat and throw me out of my own father's house when I went home later in the day. All of them refused to allow me into their houses. My uncle threatened to unleash his Jebucham on anybody who helps me. With what was happening, I didn't have any other option. Like, I went to the police station and I caught the shocker of my life. Chinea did not only bail him in less than half an hour. They also heavily bribed the police to the point that the police openly threatened to torture me to death if I come anywhere close to their station again. Even the police? Even the police. <laughs> Barista, even the police. I tried reaching you when these things were happening, but <laughs> your phone was switched off. Yeah. Um, it, it was actually faulty. I, I took it to the technicians at Okigwe to fix. But it took them so long to... In fact, that was the reason I, I, I came back late from my trip to Umaya. I'm so sorry about that. Go, go, please. You need to help me. I need your help. I am going through a lot, Uncle Nico. Please. What do you want me to do for you? Please. I want Uncle Oguchi and Chine out of my father's house. I don't want them to inherit even a pain from my father's assets. Pico, please. So, so how do you want to go about it? With um, with mom and Henry's death, I don't think there is anything my father's will would do for me right now. <laughs> and with watching it, it will be an abomination of the highest kind. If she gets anything from my father's properties, I want you to sue them, Uncle. I want the court to stop your madness once and for all and give me sole ownership to my father's properties. Please, Uncle. I want the court to handle this. I am going through a lot. Please. Allow me. 
Don't kneel before me. Don't kneel before me. Shit. Well, I have suffered so much. I have gone through a lot. Go, please. was the most outrageous. It was quite unconscionable. For Christ's sake, she is your own niece. She just lost her parents and her only brother in very tragic circumstances just recently. She is still in shock. She is yet to heal completely. How could you compound her grief in such a manner? You are her father now. No, 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 no. There you go wrong. There you go totally wrong, Barista Ugoche. I am not her father. Her father was my late younger brother, Ekekwe. Get that into your thick skull. You are late chief Ekekwe's only biological and so, brother. Eh? And so? Barista Ugoche, I ask you, and so? Let me tell you something if you don't know it. I reserve the right to choose what I inherit and what I do not inherit from my late brother. Eh? And let me tell you something. That girl is not coming into this compound anymore. And if she dares me, I will strip her naked before throwing her out of this gate. You will. You will. You will. Dare not humiliate her any further than you have done already, Okuchi. Oh, yes, really. And who is going to stop me? I Let me ask to do that. I will go to any legal length to stop you. Luto. Luto. Oh. I knew it. I knew it. I knew you have been lost in after her. You've always focused your attention on her waist and on her boss. Only God knows how many rounds of sex that idiot Right, you would you discharge a bill lawyer. Only one knows how many rounds of just sex she, she bribed you with last night that is making you commit this fire that I'm seeing here right now. What I want to just hey, 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 hey. Yeah, uh, listen, I've not finished. But so God, I will gladly come to court to defend myself if you sue me. And I ask you, will you do the same? If I sue you in the court of all the witches and wizards of Ijebu land, I'm asking you. You must. Uh, but it's to God, in case you don't know, let me remind you. Let me tell you. My late Ijebu wife was the most powerful witch in the entire land of Ijebu. I married her when I was 36 years old and she was 71 years old. Guess why I did that? Powers. Spiritual powers. Guess who she gave all her powers before she died? A me, Tom Wui. A me. Myself. Before you go any further, fooling yourself in the name of uh, defending Amarachi, be sure you are not only legally ready, but Spiritually, I will not be intimidated by such crash talk. But to God, if you ever make up your mind to stare the devil in the face, make sure you don't blink first. This devil standing before you right here and now will kill he will destroy he will devour he will massacre an entire generation just to have his way through in this issue and do not be foolish enough to let him start with your family hey if 
in the next two hours. If in the next two hours, Amarachi is still in your house, I am going to launch a devastating spiritual attack against your family that will start with your only son, Ebuka, that is in Canada. Hey, I'm not done with you yet. I'm done with you. Now get out of my house. Please, I, I don't. I said get out of my house. That didn't leave me. Go see law. I mean, dear Dini. Get out before I launch it now. Sir, uh, uh, please. Uh, I'm still on my knees. Uh, yes, I, 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 I am begging you. Get out. Don't harm my son, please. Uh, uh, oh, Lord, you go there. Yes, I, I, I huh? want to beg. Oh, I've put my family in battle right there, I don't know about you. My son, especially. Oh, don't go me. Don't, team battle right there, I don't know about you. My party, I guess. Do you believe what you want? Hey, get out. Come, go, come, go, go, where about you? Move the way about you. Make God do our, our, our phone, come, uh, 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 we are be happy. To be honest with you, Amarachi, I left that place feeling more like a ghost than human. What has Oguchi become? Why is he doing this? What if he was just playing mind games with you and others? I mean, he might just be bluffing for all we know. Of what he, after what he did to the woman that before you, and you're asking this question? Oh, well, my dear. If he's bluffing, then he chose to bluff with the most precious thing to me, Ebuka, my son. That's a very expensive bluff to me. Ebuka is, is my only child and, and you know it. I am your late friend's only child too. If you were in your shoes, uncle, would my father, who you knew very well, give up a fight on Ebuka in a similar circumstance just because he was threatened by an old buffoon? Don't, don't go, dear Amarachi. Please don't. I can't believe what I'm hearing. So what do you want? You want me to leave your house just as he demanded, right? Do you believe in destiny? I do, but... Take has... your case to the cut of destiny. Humans like me can be threatened and cowed. Human police officers and judges can be bribed and manipulated. Humans and people can disappoint you. But destiny will never, never disappoint you. Put your faith in your destiny. Why are you doing this? Why are you doing this to me, Uncle? You're asking the only surviving biological child of your late friend to consume bread of sorrow in the hands of Uncle Oguchi and Chine. You're saying whatever they do to me from now henceforth doesn't concern you? You were only concerned about your son, Ebuka, and yourself. Is that what you're doing, Uncle? Have you suddenly forgotten that my family's compassionate deed led you to meeting Ebuka in the first place? Have you forgotten? So sorry about that. <laughs> Sorry about that, Amrachi. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Uncle. Thank you. That question is fortunate to answer, not me. Um, 
sorry to ask uncle, but where is she? She went to the university where both of you are attending. She wanted to take care of one or two things. I will allow you into the house now. But when she comes back, she has the final say as to whether you continue to stay here or leave. Shoot your alone bell. I will not entertain further agreement on this. So if I will lay above, if you don't want to come in, use the gate. If you don't want to come in, I want Amarachi to defer her university admission with one year, just as I have done mine. I cannot be here with you as your wife at home while she returns to school. Never. That's one. Two, she would have to give up her phone and laptop to me. And you are not returning that car you took from her. Three, I want her to give me the password to all her social media platforms. I am going to log into them, change her passwords, log out of them all because she needs to stay off social media too. Four, and most important, I want her to close all her accounts yes but before doing that i would want her to transfer all the money in her account into mine mm. uh, I, I like that i like it very much but uh, I, I am not seeing the possibility of her doing all this without putting up any form of resistance at all the last thing i ever wanted is a repeat of the drama of the last day and a half Oh, please. Yeah. Even if she chooses to resist, which soul in this such a community will come to her help ever again? All of them are scared of you and your Ijebu child. Well, that might be true, but some busybody human rights lawyers outside the community might hear of this case and decide to pick it up for her free of charge someday. And by so doing, they will win things for us. Uh, yes, I came back from Ijebu Day with powerful charms, sure. But uh, I am not the only person who knows the way to Ijebu Day. Neither is Ijebu Day the only place in the world where powerful charms can be acquired. Some of those lawyers can even be more spiritually strong than myself. Don't forget that. Well, in that case, why don't you Strike her dead with. Uh, no, 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 no. That, that won't be necessary. That will not be necessary at all. At all. Uh, spiritually controlling her to be utterly submissive to, uh, uh, to us is a better option. By the way, who do you think people would, would suspect should anything happen to her? What do you mean? Both of us. Alternative is good. This the alternative is this. I am going to place this charm on her head while she sleeps, and the moment this charm melts spiritually into her head, she becomes our puppet automatically. The charm has an antidote that bothers me anyway, and that is love. Love? Yes. Amarachi must never fall in love genuinely. And if she does, it must never be with a man who will love her back. And even if the man loves her, 
they must never get married. Because if it happens that way, it will be of serious, in fact, of deadly consequence to whoever charmed her. You? Oh. This is a good one for us. At all. I mean, how are we going to be able to stop that from happening with a woman as beautiful as Amarach? <laughs> that should not bother you. Because it will never ever happen. Eh? Any young man who tries as much as get close to her will be dead before he realizes what hit him. I will strike the idiot with the most deadly evil power known to man. doing in my room at this time of the night? Will you shut up? What sort of stupid question is that? Last I checked, this entire building belongs to my husband. And that gives us the right to enter into any room of our choice. Now tell me, do you have any problem with that? I am asking you, do you have a problem with that? Do you? No. Very good. We are here to talk. Or better put, to give you the conditions upon which you will continue to stay in this house. On your camera. Listen, henceforth, you will make sure you tidy everywhere in this house.
Ebuka. Oh, nice car. Congratulations. Welcome. Um, honey. Hey, darling. This is Ebuka. Barista of gorgeous Canada based. So. Oh, yes. I think I. I saw him at the funeral of. Um, Ekegwe and uh, Lovina. Exactly. I remember his face. He's the one. But I, I, I never knew him to be this confused and morose looking young man standing before me. Mbo, I learned you were a graduate of uh, economics here in Nigeria before you traveled to uh, uh, Canada mm -hmm. to read medicine. Did you change course from reading medicine to study moping and mark opening in Canada? Did you? Oh my goodness. What is going on here? Huh? Chineye? Chineye, is this not Uncle Oguchi? Your father's elder brother? Chineye? Hey, hey. What? what, what? Don't, don't, don't you try it. Don't you scream my name like that again. Ebuka, don't. If you want to call my wife's name, call her name with respect. Mrs. Oguchi. What? Yes. What is going on here? Am I dreaming or what? <laughs> Where is Amarachi? 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 Osom. Oh. Hanim. Even Ayankim. Amarachi? Amarachi? Oh. Amarachi? Amarachi? Come. No, no, no. Amarachi? 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 Wait, let me just. Hold on, Martin. No, 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 no. Hold on. Oh, oh, come on, come on, come on. Look, look at it now. You have wounded her. Sorry, okay. I'm so sorry. You are supposed to be inside, aren't you? Yes, I am. I'm Raji. I don't need to remind you that you have three drums of, I mean, three empty drums to fill with water. And the last time I checked, it was just one that you failed. You mean two. If you like, stand there and waste your life, waste your time with this, this good for nothing person standing before you here. Hey, stop it there, sir. I said stop it. Right? Let me tell you. Wherever this is, I want it to end now. Did you hear what I said? Um, see that. I will ignore the dog that just barked now. Mm -hmm. And you, Udene, go and complete your assignment. Or oh, a man, you know. What did you just call her? Udi Uli E Udene. The book in the language. Angulu for Hausa and in English. Culture. How dare you? How dare you? Amarachi. 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 Really? Amarachi. Really now? Oh, so, because he came here with this, this rubbish, he thinks he can talk to you. Just imagine that. Honey, you know what? I want you to use your Iwobo remote to set this nonsense ablaze. You have a good idea. Eh? Meanwhile, <laughs> let, the, let the music play on. No, no, honey. Eh? I know you can do it. Let the music it's play just on. for you two. Eh? And this car will vamoose now. Amarachi, Amarachi, what is going on? What happened to you? Eh? Who reduced you to this? 
Amarachi. What is going on? Talk to me. Talk to me, please. Talk to me. What is going on? What happened? Eh? Leave me alone. Amarachi. Why? No, please tell me what happened. What what happened to you? Can you can you can you explain that? Just leave me. Talk to me, please. Amarachi, please. Can you stop crying? Stop crying and talk to me. Please. I just want to go and fetch my water. Leave me alone. Tell me what what happened? What happened? No! Amarachi! 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 How could you, Father? How could you keep me in the dark about this whole thing? For six months, I called you severally on phone, asking after Amarachi and Chinoy. I told you I was worried for them, that I could not get them on phone or any of their social media handles. But he kept on assuring me that they were okay, that they are fine, that I shouldn't get worried, I should relax. That them being out of social media or any of their phone contacts was a deliberate action for them to heal better from their numerous losses and for them to keep people from not disturbing them. Is that what you told me, Father? Why did you lie to me, Father? Why did you lie to Love me? Of that, Ebuka. Or Gucci threatened to kill you and I if we get involved with whatever thing he does in that family. And for that, you're checking out? He's a desperate and dangerous man. You are all I have. Father, from all I heard from Chine, Amarachi is also all that her late father had. Her late father, you were his personal lawyer. She is my friend. And we found each other because of her and her family. Why did you betray the trust and the friendship you had with her late father? Why, father? Why are you doing this? I, I don't want to lose you, son. I don't want to die. Oh, I see. You don't want to die. You don't want us to die, too. You're more concerned about us. What about her life? What about Amarachi, father? You will not get involved in her case. Okay. Too late. Too late, father. Not after what I saw today. That lady is mentally, emotionally, and physically abused by that buffoon and Chine. And God forbid I, I will sit aside and watch like you and other villagers. I will not allow that to continue. I will not. You will not dare me. I will dare you, Father. I will dare you. I will even dare the devil on this issue. Excuse me. What are you doing here? I'm here to help you I... fetch water and fill the drums as they wanted. Uh, no, no. You, you're not supposed to be here. You can't be doing this. Marachi, I was a hopeless and an abandoned nobody whose life was transformed when he made contact with you and your kind family. But yes, for friendship's sake, for being grateful for all you've done for me, I'm here to be with you in this time of crisis. I'm ready to help you any way you want me to. Please don't say no, right? 
Let me, let me, let's, let's. And, and the, wait, I'm grateful you're trying to do that. But they will not react well to this. Don't you worry. You are all that matters to me. Your happiness is all that I want. I'm ready to help you any way you want me to. I'm ready to be with you. Okay? Don't say no, let's do this. Right? Help me fix this. I'm sorry I came back late. There were too much people at this stream. I, I, I didn't intend to stay late. Come on, Achi. Come, let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. go. <laughs> you said I was lying. Baby, see them with your own eyes. And? What do you think you're doing with her? Ebuka? Helping her fetch water faster, sir. As her what, if I may ask you? Hmm? As her what? As a grateful friend of hers and her family. <laughs> Ebuka, if you care so much about her, stop this rubbish this minute. Mm -hmm. Sorry to disappoint you, sir. I will not. Ebuka, stop it. Don't talk to my uncle like that. What's wrong with you? Uncle, oh, please, I, I'm sorry for. Hey, hey, stop, March. I said stop. Just stop it. Do you know you're going to put me in trouble? What is wrong with you? Stop it. I said stop it. You go home and let me be in peace. Peace? You call what they have reduced you to peace? What manner of peace is that? It is none of your business. Let's go. And I will slap you again and again if you open up your mouth in front of me and speak like their slave. I'm at you. I'm at you. I'm at you. I'm at you. Now listen. I don't know what you guys did to her. But I want you to know one thing. As far as I live, I must do everything within my power to undo it. Oh yes, I swear, I must undo it. Watch and see. Say something. Honey, will... say something. I will not do something. Do what? Watch and see. Just watch me and see. I go abroad, Make those demands of you that night. I agreed to everything they demanded. You agreed to defy your university admission in your final year? You agreed to close your bank accounts and give Chinaye all the money in it? 
you agree to hand over your laptop, your your car, and um, your phones to them. Amarachi, after all they did to you and your late parents, you agree to, to, to hand over your password to Chineye that gave her the access and control to log you out of your social media platforms. What went wrong, Amarachi? Were you under a spell? I was abandoned. Everybody abandoned me, including your father. They were all scared of my uncle. Everybody left me at their mercy. Even the spirits of my parents and brother. What would you have had me do? Commit suicide? No. You're not going to kill yourself for them. Don't even think it. Right? Don't even think about it. I'm so sorry, okay? I'm sorry for my father's failure to stand by you when you needed him most. I'm so sorry for everything. I'm sorry for all that happened. I'm also sorry for not reaching you for almost six months. Right? I'm sorry. I'm frustrated. I am traumatized. Life is so mean. And Uncle Oguchi and Chine are making it unbearable for me. I don't even know what to do. You know, sometimes I I try to muster courage to fight back. Even when they physically assault me, <laughs> I say to myself that I would definitely fight back. But at the end, I go back on my knees begging them. I don't know what's going on. It's okay. It's okay. I totally understand. <laughs> right? I, I know your uncle. I know that that evil man can go any length to have his way. <laughs> And I'm sure that Buffon and Chineye must have done something beyond the extraordinary to you. I'm so sorry about it. But just know that I'm here for you. Whatever that has happened, let it trash it out. I'll stand with you. Okay? Are you sure? Yes, I'm sure. I'll stand with you till you prevail against them. Okay? Don't worry yourself. I'm so sorry for everything. Right? Sorry. 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 Stop crying. Let's go. Let's go to the stream of fresh water. You're welcome. Get him off my niece's life. But it's Ugoji. I say it again. Get your lousy son off my family affairs. I will not want him again. It's not as if I don't know what to do to him. You. I'm going to him and me. Okay? And if you think I am issuing an empty threat, watch out for this. No matter how little a deity is, it is never lifted with one hand. Look at it. This is called Ibubo Yumori. It is a very deadly and very powerful charm from the land of Ijebu. From Ijebu Igbo to Ijebu Ode, Ijebu Ode to Ijebu Ona. If I tell you what I went through to acquire and possess this, you will block your ears with stones. And I did not go through such horror for fun. Neither did I come back to this Archer village to give chance to straight dogs like your, like your son to, 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 to ride me and leave. Warn your son. Warn your son before you bury him. Shut, 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 shut up. Don't talk to me. Talk to your son. Talk to him. Talk to him before I unleash the wrath of Igubo uh, Dimori on him. 
warn him seriously because I will not come here to warn you again. Aguchi, please. Don't Agu talk to me. Don't talk to me. Talk to your son. You want the money is not a, a, a friendly charm. It kills first and ask questions later. Ebuka, where are you? Come back to this house right now. I said, come back to this house right now. I said, don't dare question me or defy me on this one. Ebuka, I said, come back to this house. I'll make you fatherless. I mean every word of it. I mean it. This boy is trying to turn me into a prima ballerina material. But I will not give him time to hurt me. I will not. Uh, oh, Gucci is a uh, dangerous and a uh, desperate man. He, he will waste you if you don't stop. Yes. Father, a man must die for something. And yes, if a man must die before his time, it is better to die for something honorable that he believes in. I, Ebuka Ugoji, I believe in justice and fairness. I believe in true friendship. I believe in confronting evil to defeat evil. And what I'm doing in Amarachi's case is called defending justice. It is called having compassion. It is called honoring friendship. It is called confronting evil to stop it. Fear. Fear has no room in such things. Ebuka, you are my only child. The frustrations and the humiliations that I suffered before I met you. Hey, hey, Father, please. Stop it. Please. You need to try other things. Because whatever thing you're saying now has no effect on me. Alton! What are you really bad in this village? To commit suicide and return me to the drama of childlessness again? Because I am important. You are my only child. Yes, you are my only child. With this, you've lost it. You just poured gasoline into a raging fire. Come back here. Have you been sleeping with that girl? Look into my face and answer me. Have you been sleeping with that girl? Father, I've never been disappointed in anyone as I am with you at the moment. Ebuka, come back here! Ebuka! Ebuka, come back! Come back here! I am talking to you! By the time I left his compound, he was already dead in his fear. In fact, I saw him going to every length possible to stop Ebuka from further disturbing our peace. All this round and round stuff you keep threatening him and his father, it's not exciting me anymore. Uh -uh. Use your child to kill or spiritually drive him away from Amarachi. Uh. Is it until he moves from having pity on her to falling in love with her before you understand the threat he poses? Kill him now. You, you, you have a point. How dare you? That's him. Mr. Gucci! Please, please, please. Mr. Gucci! Mr. Gucci! Mr. Gucci! Mr. Gucci! What happened to my account? I am no. Ebuka. Ebuka. Huh? So, what are you doing? Hey, shut up! Okay, no, no. How dare you step into my father's compound to pull that stunt that you pulled today? 
How dare you harass my father like that, you coward? Eh? I am not what did you just call me? A dirty, drooling coward. That is who you are. Marisa, no, no, no. take him out of my compound now before I, I, I send him to Eli, his early grave with my people. Hey. I will do just that. 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 Good boy. You should be grateful he did not tear your lips. Hmm. But my teeth are shaking. Hmm. Hey, hmm. sorry. Are you this one? Isn't this ways? Or check out the customers and all. Oh, hey, Buka. Hey, Buka. Your days are not bad. On this year, it will never be well with you. You will die before your time. Where will you go? On this year, we will die before you. We will go more. Look, just imagine. Eh? Baby. Eh? Look, this is not a time to swear and do nothing. You have to do something. You have to do something. Yeah. Because we cannot be oddly disgraced like this. The people of Acha community must not see that this boy came here, humiliated you, and they still see him leave. No. It will be a very big insult. We will, we will have more respect though. Even uh, Egede, the village drunk, yeah. will have more respect than you. Kill him now. Even Egede? Yes. Hi.
Ebuka. Uruko usu kini. Uruko usu kini. Furu moku. Uruko usu keji. Agbama weba mweni. Uruko usu keta. Obinyo se finu honi liaye. Toma fe pa fe be yele. E yele a fu lorere. Toma fe badaba. Adaba a fu lorere. E tu wa wotye diye. Iri kisi ni ojeke diye fu. I wa wafe sora re. Ebuka. Oh wafe sora re. Ah. Ebuka, you are dead. You are as good as dead. Wherever you are now, you fat in wala umo. Eh, you go limori. You go limori. You go limori. Emit the black evil smoke and go after Ebuka wherever he is and kill him. Let him drop dead now. Now. No, 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 Listen, if you have been looking for a reason to kill him before, eh? this is it. Kill him now. Eh? Ah, I know. Uh -uh. I cannot kill him. I cannot kill him. I cannot. I don't understand. Why can't you kill him? Uh. Obin, eh? there's something. There is, there is something I did not tell you before now. You will be Ugur Muri is useless against anyone who is in love with the victim of the other charm we used against the, uh, 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 Amarachi. I know the power can harm him as long as we or people working for us are involved in it. Yeah. Okay, then hire assassins to track him down and kill him physically. Hey, what have you got on me here? It seems you're not getting my point. Physically or spiritually, we cannot do anything against them. If we try it, yeah, we are doomed. Hey. Yes, his father. His father. Yes. If you cost him a huge loss, I'm sure you will back off Amrachi. Do it! That one too cannot work. Ha! Huh. You know, bossy. You know, JJ, it's not possible. Oh, eh? Let me tell you something. Anyone related to him by blood cannot be harmed by us now. Even the object of his love, uh, Amrachi, is already enjoying the protection equally. Baby, you, you can't let this happen. You can't. I'm, 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 I'm sure that. There must be some other way to. I cannot do anything. Okay, okay. The only thing we can do is manipulate her marriage to make sure she doesn't fall in love with him too. Why we put our brains to work to scare him off with some kind of bluff? No, 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 no. This is not good. Just bluff. Eh, bluff. And if he fails. Ah, penuwalawa. That is where we have problem. Hey, only me.
with what Amarachi did today, is it not clear enough that she does not really want what you think you came to this country to give to her? Want is different from need, Father. Fear may be driving her into believing she does not want all that I've been doing for her. But the truth is that she definitely needs it. There we go. Pack your luggage and return to your studies in Canada immediately. No, Father. No. Not now. With what he did to that useless and wicked man in his compound a while ago, he will definitely come after you with all he has. The only way you stand a chance maybe is to go back to Canada. Then I can go to him with our kinsmen to beg him to spare your life. Father. If with all that happened in that compound today, You've not realized that that buffoon has been bluffing with you guys all in the name of possessing a charm from Ichibu. Then it's quite unfortunate. You think that is bluffing? You think a beautiful and a promising young lady like uh, Chinonye who willingly agreed to become his wife? You think she betrayed the family that gave her life the way she did is because she fell in love with a, a man who is old enough to be her grandfather? Assuming I agree with you, Father. Do you realize that Amarachi could also be a victim of the same charm he used on Chinoye? What do you think the same charm would do to you if he continued to poke nose into the affairs? I don't know. But I cannot give up because of the fear of the known. It is not called the fear of the known. It is called common sense. When did you become suicidal, for God's sake? Father. I am not. Nothing will happen to me. Nothing will happen to me. I need your services tomorrow. There is something I would want you to do for me. Which is? Sue him. Yes. Sue Mr. Oguchi and I will... Cut me off that fool! If you have made up your mind to die before your time, I have not! Arabs nonsense. Anything about charm? Really? I am also worried about uh, Ibuguri Mori's re uh, reaction at being used for such bluffs. That that charm is 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 too is way too mean. I, 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 I don't get it. Wait. I thought you told me that Ibuguri Mori does not harm anyone who possesses it. Was that a lie? Uh, you know. Uh, it's, you know, you know, you know, you know, it's not a lie. Uh, then let's do it. You, you don't expect us to fold our arms and do nothing, uh, you know, until the other plan matures. That is very risky. The stakes are really too high. We have to do something. Chine, Uncle. You called? Yes. Baby, please. 
Ajmo na čik. Ti mi mention that thing here. Ora ci sono scoglie, ci sono i miei. Ora. Amorati. Put your hands inside this circle. I repeat after me. I said, you see, if you make me repeat myself, I will ask you to strike you dead here and now. Chine. You need to... Don't. If you call my name one more time, I will tell my husband here to strike you dead instantly. It's simple. Just do as he says. Put your two hands together and put it in between this line. Just put it already. Put your two hands together and put it in between the line. Wait. Honey, I think it's time to strike her. No, no, I want to put it in the sense. Put your hands into this circle. Quick! Put it well. Get it better very well. Good. Good. Now repeat after me. Oh, it's more than more. Oh, it's more than more. If I ever allow Ebuka to come anywhere close to me again. If, if I ever allow Ebuka to come anywhere close to you again. Conscience. Muni, if I ever allow Ebuka to come anywhere close to me again, you are managing. No, Uncle, you said me. That is you now. My friend, you want to, she wants to get me angry. She wants to get me angry. Okay, okay. Put your hand inside. Now repeat after me. If I ever allow Ebuka come anywhere close to me Amarachi again. If I ever allow Ebuka come anywhere close to me Amarachi again. Let Ibuko remove it. Strike me, I'm ready with incredible madness. Go ahead. <laughs> I had to go deeper into the forest for me to get enough. I wouldn't want them to send you here again anytime soon. Wait a minute. I thought you said your father asked you to go and get firewood. Or you were getting firewood for your father. Amarachi. The truth is that my father does not use firewood to cook. He uses gas stove. And it's not an evil man like your uncle and Chine who send you here to come and fetch firewood almost every day. Even though they have gas stove and do not need firewood. Only God knows how they sleep at night with evil in their hearts. Well, like you said, only God knows. Um, well, uh, Amarchi. Mm. What you told me about um, Chine, is it true? Well, um, unfortunately it is. She lost her pregnancy and she was told at the hospital that her reproductive system might not function well again. Meaning she might not be able to give birth again. Oh, wow. So, um, what really happened to her? Well, maybe this time the spirit of my parents decided to rise against them and fight for me. Wow. Well, I'm not a superstitious person. 
but if that was the case, then they are indirectly telling you that I'm doing the right in fighting for you. Thank you. You're welcome. Thank you very much. I'm taking these risks because you are human and you deserve better. Right? I've sued your uncle though. Really? Pack up, let's go. Thank you. You're welcome. Don't worry, let me handle it. Let me handle it. How did you get this, please? A court belief brought it to me a while ago. What? So Ebuka went ahead to see you as a threatened? After I refused to do it for him? Oh God, what have I done to this boy? What have I done? But to Goji, this is a red line for me. I, I, I have tolerated this boy all this while simply because you have been begging on his behalf. And it was it's that of the picture I have for you. Oh, okay. But this time around, he has actually pushed me beyond my elasticity. Oh, no, no, I can't take it anymore. No, 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 no. Don't, don't, don't try. Don't try. You see, let me tell you something. My coming here to inform you about this before I take the actions I want to take is my last act of mercy. Barista, warn him. Or better still, advise him to withdraw all the charges he is pressing against me and go back to Canada where he came from. If you don't want to carry his corpse. Oh, oh, yes. Oh, hey, 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 please, oh, oh, Gucci, don't harm him, right? Don't huh? harm him. I, I, I will make sure that this case is withdrawn immediately, right? I, I, and uh, of course, I, I thank God that the, the barrister that he contracted is my best friend. Oh. Well, and he, he will leave this village immediately. I'm assuring you. This whole nonsense will be withdrawn and discharged. It's better. Please, it has better be. Nobody will say I did not give him enough space to save himself. Okay. Eh? God knows that since the painful miscarriage of my wife, I, 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 I am no longer in the mood for all this nonsense. I no longer cut out for that. Want him. It's okay. It's quite pitiable. But uh, my, count me on my words. He, he will listen to me. He's my son, Oguchi. Talk to him. Oh, but Oguchi, please, be on the soft pedal for me. Ha! Ah, this boy. Ebuka. Anyway, so, please stop. Stop. Put yourself together. Eh? Just to cheer up. Let me tell you, his father that I saw some moments ago, we go to any length in forcing him to back off this time around. And the moment that is done, we will have every space to carry out our plans against Amarachi. What do you think? If you will worry more, we cannot harm Ibuka. Can he not at least restore my childbearing ability? My dear, calm down. <laughs> Calm down. You see, I, I was telling you about. Uh, I heard what you said. That is not my problem. Don't you understand the dilemma I am in as a woman? I do. I do. I lost my child. And then. Sorry, 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 sorry. sorry. I'm, I'm, I'm a little pain as well. What, don't you know what it takes to, to get a woman pregnant? You know how you know the stress, the pains are passed through to get to get to get you pregnant. Come down, right? Climbing all this here and coming down. It's not it's not a chance play. To Moluti to Ben now, Bele.
Good evening. Uh, af af afternoon. Uh, af good afternoon. Good day, sir. Dad, you know the reason I'm leaving this village, right? Because of your promise. You vowed that you will liaise with Barista Alieke to take up that case. I want that idiot prosecuted as soon as possible, please. Okay? Thank Be you. rest assured that I will do just that. Thank you. Uh, thank you for uh, convincing me at last that fighting for her is a noble and right thing to do. Thank you too for allowing me to convince you. All right? Please. I would love you to take care of her. Take care of her for my sake. Thank you very much, Barista. Thank you so much. It's okay. And to you too. Thank you. God bless you. You're welcome. Um, you don't need to worry. You can always count on me for anything. Whatever thing he has done to you in the past few days, I will do many times over for your sake. Thank you. Um, Oguchi's um, madness must stop very soon. Thank you so Trust much. Trust me. Thank you for that. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Well, um, I will drop the car with the dealer in a worry. He will sell the car and transfer the money to him. He will use it to open an account for you, bank account for you. Yes. Yes. I will send the money to you monthly. Monthly? Yes. Oh, no, you don't have to do that. that. That's too much. I don't want you to go through such stress. Moreover, you're still studying. You need money as well. Don't worry yourself, okay? I know I'm still studying, but I will do anything for you, right? Moreover, I'm working part time, so I'm fine. Don't worry yourself, right? Thank you. You're welcome. All right, take care. Thank you. I have said that. I appreciate it. <laughs> I'll see you. I'll call you. Mm -hmm. Rest carefully. Thank you. Thank you. Uh -huh. Let's go back to the house.
Otobo. It's me, your coach, your cousin. The only one. Yes. Oh, what a wonderful <laughs> man. Uh, please, can you just help me uh, remove this? I will do that. Bochi! And open the veil. Bochi! And open the veil. Uh, please, can you help me also with it? I will uh, let them go. Okay. Bochi! And open the veil. <laughs> Oh, yes, 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 yes. Mochi! And open the veil. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> that is me. Yeah. Mochi! Yeah, and open the veil. Yeah, welcome to her. Yeah, back room. Mochi! And open the veil. Mochi! And up and up. Oh, double. <laughs> huh? Here we are. My compound. <laughs> really? Oh, yes. This is your compound? Oh, yes. You thought I was boasting when I told you I now own a mansion and the biggest produce trading firm in Acha and environs, which was originally owned by my younger brother before he died. Utobo, Utobo. Uh, your good old friend is now Ogayangada. Baba Olowo, Kishi Omo Baba Olowo, Baba Olowo for a ride. Emini eh? Ha! Monty! And up and the vest. This is your compound? Oh yes. My compound. Monty! And up and the vest. What is it? Anyway, that's by the way. I, I love this Panya style of handshake you told me today. Uh, Utobo. Yes. I missed our days together as young men in this village. Honestly. And uh, we'll be having a, a lot of catching up. Oh, yes. Days ahead. Oh, yes, we will. Yes, we will. <laughs> my good <laughs> friend. Come and meet my precious wife. Oh, really? Oh, yeah, baby. Watch it and open the veil. Watch it and open the veil. Come on, Mikla. Watch it, my precious wife. And open the veil. <laughs> One more. Oh, you can. What My good old friend. Mm. Yes. Welcome. He's been in Panya since 32 years. Oh. Udubu. Only my precious wife. What a beautiful woman. Thank you. Watch it and open the bed. Thank you. You're welcome, sir. Yes, yes. Okay, um. Thank you, my dear. Udubu, come on, sit down. Watch it and open the bed. Hey, 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 you come here, come here, come here. Oh, sorry, sir. Uh, Utobu, this is uh, Amarachi, my younger brother's daughter. Mochi and open the veil. And you, go inside, go and get me the bottle of snow. Okay, sir, welcome. Sweet. And open the veil. Dobo, mm -hmm. my status may have changed, but my taste has not. Aromatic snap is still my best hot drink. Same here. <laughs> Same here. Mochi and open the veil. Mochi and open the veil. You and this mochi, mochi, open the veil. What? Mochi and open the veil. Wow. Yeah. 
Good. I'm not going to go to the house. 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 I'm not it's like asking the housefly if it would like to perch on a decomposing corpse. I had to stop you because I consider it as an insult. Taking this heavenly liquid inside this cup, it is an insult to the spirit inside it. Ah. Huh? Udobo. Tu vas pas me dire que tu as un peu de temps. 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 Tu as un peu my friend Ogochi, you are a rich man, are you not? Yes, I am. Of course I am. Uh, yes, get more, get more. Uh, Amarachi, please go and bring another bottle. I said go and bring another bottle. Oh, chief, and open the vent. Oh. Marachi, and open the vent. Oh, Ogochi, is the drink coming from Congo Brazzaville? Utubo, calm down. She will soon be here with it. Watch it and open the vent. Watch it and open the vent. Watch it and open the vent. Utubo. I guess that is the title they gave you when you did what you just did for us now in Banya. No, no. Watch it and open the veil is an exclamation for my former girlfriend in Panya. When Mumuwa Otobo Wakborogo is on top of her, grinding her red paper. Ogochi, that is a bedroom ringing tone. I can't quite remember what she said is the meaning, but for me, here and now, it means God bless my soul. Bless your soul and this ukubara. Ukubara. What, what, what is the meaning of that? Are you stupid or something? Hey, shut up. Don't no, no, mind how you talk to Tobo. What a priest. <laughs> so? He's not on my touching. Did he use cutlet on you? Come on, get, get, get inside. I said, get inside. Such soft, pretty bottom. Watch it and open the veil. She's my younger brother, said daughter. A daughter. You've said that before. It's liking high crime. No. Ha. Not at all. Watch it and open the veil. Do you like her? Very much. In fact, I want to have her as my wife, if you agree. How about that? You are very powerful indeed. Huh? So fast. So fast. Open the veil. March and open the veil. Masi, please just hold yourself. Hold yourself. I'm tired. Eh? Jesus Christ. 
Yes. Please scoop it. Marchy! And open the door. Marcy, keep quiet. Please keep quiet. Yeah. I will keep quiet, my love. My sweetheart. Yes. See, I swear to God, if you as much as call me, call me that name again, I will drop you here and go home. How many times have I warned you today, Lord, not, not to address me like that? Eh? Marchy! And open the door. Mommy, open up and the I'm sorry. I forgot. Let's go. Let's go, please. Marcy, please hold yourself. Marchy and open the door. Oh, Jesus, Jesus. Hi. Chai. Oh, God. Tina, yeah. God will punish the two of you for humiliating me this way. God will punish the two of you for forcing me to take, take this idiot home. Eh? Tobo. Please just hold yourself. Let me pick up this cap. Hold yourself now. <coughs> Jesus Christ. Hi. Please just move. Let me drop you in your house. March and open the door. Shut up. Just keep quiet. Let me know what I'm dealing with. Marchy and open the vest. Marcy, hold yourself now. Hold yourself. I'm tired. I'm tired now. Uh-uh. Marchy and open the vest. Marchy and open the vest. Utobu, can you just keep short so that we can get to your house? We're here already. Save this energy, Biko. Marchy. <laughs> I open the verb. Oh, Jesus. What about move now? What is it? What? My good gracious. Thank you, my love, for helping me back to the comfort of my bedroom. she calls a friend. This thing, after the show of shame you put up in the house, they still forced me to bring you back home. Anyway, Amarachi shouldn't even be asking. Anything that would humiliate me is fun to them. I shouldn't be surprised. Idiot. Let me go. Jesus Christ. Let me go home and wash this, this thing off my body. Also, give us all the back. Sleep there. You called me. Yes, I called you. Um, I called to tell you that my precious wife here and I have decided to grant your request to be allowed to learn a vocational craft. Yeah, hold on, I've not finished. Yes, pending when you go back to the university to complete your education. As soon as you make up your mind on what to learn, let us know so that payment can be made to whoever will teach you 
bring us that. Hey. Really? Yes. Hey, Uncle, thank you very much. Thank you so much. Thank you. God bless you. You make heaven, Uncle. You are very good. Yeah. You said you will make heaven. You will make heaven for me. You, are you wishing me dead? No, I, I, I didn't mean it that way. I was, I was only just trying to show how grateful I am. Have I finished enjoying these things and you're asking me to go to heaven back now, this early? Uh, sorry, sorry, sir. Uh, thank you. Uh, hey, thank you, Uncle. Uh, sorry. Uh, sir. Sorry. You're welcome. Um, I have made up my mind on what I want to learn, Uncle. Uh, yes, I, I, I want to learn bead making. There's a woman from Mazara community, our neighboring community I want to learn from. Okay. I've spoken to her about it already. Okay, so uh, how much is she charging? She said I'll have to pay 40,000 Naira for two months intensive training. Uh, yes, but the money can be paid in installments. Really? Uh, 40,000 Naira. Okay. In that case, we, we're going to <clears throat> make bullet payments to her. Sir? I said we are going to give her bullet payment. That is, you want to shoot her? We are going to pay her once, no installments. Yes, and uh, in addition to that, you will be receiving one thousand five hundred naira every day to cover up for your transportation and feeding. Thank you very much, Uncle. Thank you, <laughs> thank you, Chinaye. Thank you very much. You all are very nice. Thank you. Thank you so much. Thank you. I don't understand. If he wanted to kneel to thank, you can actually kneel to thank. Ah, uh, it's not a problem. Thank you. I should actually kneel. Thank you very much. I can stand up. Thank you. Thank you, Uncle. Let me check what I put on the fire. You see, this whole thing is out of the magnanimity of her heart that this is coming from. Mm -hmm. yeah. God bless you too. Thank you. And open the bed. Let me fill my cup. Watch it and open the bed. Watch it and open the bed. Yes. Oh. Here comes the lady of the moment. My love, my Odara, my morning star. Yes. <laughs> oh, please get away from oh, me. Oh. Hey! Get away from me. What is the meaning of this nonsense? Have you gone bonkers? Amarachi, what, what did you just do? Amarachi. What's in Petsus? That is a wrong wrestling move, my Odara. Throwing Utobo Borogo without warning is a wrong word. Uh, am I wrong? Uh, no, you're never wrong, Utobo the Great. You're not. You had it from your uncle, didn't you? Uh, please, please, Uncle Obuchi. I beg you in God's name. I want this drunk here to stop addressing me like that, else I will break his head one day. What is wrong with you? Oh, shut up your mouth and go and help him up. What? Do not make me repeat myself. You heard me. That is an abominable thing to do to your... Hey, 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 hey! Utobo! Watch it and open the bed. Watch And open the bed. Utubu, try and stand up. March And open the bed. Utubu! Ogarangada! Ogoche, my friend. Do you still have more bottles in your house? I have many more bottles for you, but if you don't sit down, you will not get it. It's okay. Utobo Wamporogu will quietly and obediently sit down. Yes. 
I'm up on the verb. I'm Anachi. Sir? That was too bad for you to do to a man who is old enough to be your father. Yes, I, I understand your, 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 your disgust, but uh, there are other ways to handle it than going physical. Uncle, I'm hey, sorry, but hey. I... Hey, Amanachi, you will have to apologize to him by coming before me now, collect a cup of palm wine from me, go before him, kneel down, take a sip and hand it over to him. Much and open the verb. Uncle, I, I will not entertain any argument on that if you don't want to clash with me right here and now. Now come forward. Much and open the verb. Take it. Do you have to kneel down? Yes. Need and collect it for me. March and open the verb. What? Capi yo. March and open the verb. March and open the verb. <laughs> no, 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 no. On your nails. Uncle. I said, go down on your knees before giving him the palm wine. March and open the verb. And you have to sip it before handing it over to him. March and open the verb. And open the verb. March and open the verb. Uh, how much you can you can now go? March and open the verb. I hope you record everything. Of course. Very good. Very well. Utobo, hmm? um, congratulations, Ogum Utobo. Natamia. Uh. How noble is the suicidal madness that I'm sure you're back to start all over with, with Oguchi and, and his cause. Hey. Daddy, can you calm down? Hmm? You know you're a fine man. Please calm down. Well, uh, I'm not here to fight Mr. Oguchi. No. And yes, I'm aware that you did not keep to your promise of prosecuting him after I left for Canada. Rather, you and Amarachi opted for out of the court settlement. She told me everything, Dad. She even told me how you and her uncle made her vow not to tell me. That's not nice. But anyway, that's not the reason I'm here. And why are you back in the country? Why? Can we discuss that on inside? Hmm? Oh, Bobby. <laughs> Let's go in, please. Right? Thank you, someone.
sorry, please, eh? Um, let me join my friend. No vets are there, yeah? yeah? Thank you very much. No vets. Amarachi. What? I know you would ask the reason I came back again, right? Yes. I mean, I'm surprised. <laughs> well, I will tell you. Just enter the car. Let's get to somewhere private. I will tell you, okay? We have to get to somewhere private before you tell me. Amarachi, can you stop, please? Enter the car. I will tell you, right? Let's go. Please. I will okay. tell you. Why did you stop the car? I stopped to answer your question. You asked, why did I come back to the country again? And my answer is, I came back because I found out almost immediately I left the country. <laughs> what did you find out? That I'm in love with you. Oh, yes. I found out more than any other thing that, that it was the love I have for you that drove me to take all the risks that I took when I came back the last time. And I will... Um, please, please, Ibuka, just um, stop. Stop. Amarachi, I love you. Please, can I call you mine? I'm in love with you, Amarachi. I'm deeply in love with you. Allow me to be your man. Oh, you and this moji na on pandeve. You've not actually told me what it means. Eh? That is the ringing tone of my former dear friend Panya. Ringing tone. And it is not your own ringing tone. Eh? <laughs> Here comes Onye Kim. Or you know Bim. Or some. If Nanyam look at that here. <laughs> Mochi and open the vet. Utubu, Mkwabela. Let us pray. Let us pray. Wait, let me pray to the gods. Didn't you pray when you woke up today? I did pray. I prayed. In my prayer, I blessed everything, including this drink. So there is no point for us to bow God or the gods while Utobo, the son of Borogu, is waiting to do justice <laughs> to his best friend that is inside this place. <laughs> Let me have your cup. <laughs> hey! Oguchi, uh, let me help you. <laughs> you are my house, or I should be the one. Uh, no, 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 you can have this. <laughs> and then Utobo can always. Uh, Enjoy yourself. Oh, 
How dare you? Ebuka, how dare you? Ebuka, what are you back and doing with my niece? And how dare you come into my compound? Now, get out. If you know the way you drove in, drive out. Sir, please, we come in peace. What? Ebuka, there is no peace between you and this family until you stop meddling in our affairs. I have. I have, Chineye. Amarachi told me how the case I instituted before I left Nigeria, how it was withdrawn. Though that is not the reason we are here. We do not have a problem with that. We are here because I want to say sorry. I want to apologize for all the wrong words I've used against you and Mr. Oguchi. I'm so sorry. Please find a place in your heart and forgive me. Uh, what, is, what is this drama for? Tell me. It's no drama, sir. It's a genuine peace move. Amarati and I are in love with each other. And we want to do that in peace. Son is daring me again. Stop him. If not, this time around, even if your tears flows like a river across my bedroom, I will not mind it. I don't get it. I will never tolerate it again. Ibuka swore never to fight you again. He, he, he said he came back to the village to cultivate a healthy relationship that with That healthy relationship is, is what I don't want to hear. To me, it is more unacceptable than every other thing he did in the past. Yes. They are both adults. Adults? Okay. There are many other women in, this, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the world. Let him go and look for another person and stay off Amarachi. Amarachi is a fire. A raging fire that will consume him. He confused me even the more. Deal with your confusion. Deal with your confusion. Want your son to stay off Amarachi? If not, if not, he heard it all that I can off her. Oh, if you don't make one more, I'll Oh, if you don't make one, I'll Hear it all that I can off her. This is not the way you are thinking. Uh, please, come back. You are getting it wrong. It's not what you think. Oguchi. This man is wild. Um, and with that, he walked away angrily. Oh. So what are you going to do? Tell me to forget the woman I love because of what he told you to do? Hmm. Honestly, I fear for you. I fear for Amarachi too. But I respect love. Thank you, Dad. Thank you very much, sir. I was... What do we do now? Well, I suggest we... We stop joining issues with him. Let's just ignore him and continue with our love the more. What if he just... I'm down, I'm I support what Ebuka just said. I am with both of you every step of the way, this time around. If that is for better for worse, I am sure that your parents expect no less from me wherever they are watching us now. Thank you so much, Father. Thank you. Thank um, you very much, sir. You're welcome. Thank you. It's okay. 
how did he go? Did he give you his word that he will do whatever it takes to stop them from saying? Did he? Uh, that was the impression I got before I left him. What do you mean? I, I don't know. Anyway, let us not waste our time talking about them. Instead, I suggest we plan on how to stop them ourselves. The stakes are just too high for too much talk now. Yeah, right. Thank you. Um, where is Utobo? That old fool. He has gone home. Really? He was too drunk to be of any use to us now. Oh. That man. His drunkenness is beginning to get me worried a lot. Honestly. We need him sober so that we can achieve the purpose we need him for. Honey. Yeah. You know what? What? Perhaps it is time to enlist the help of Iwogo Rimori on him. What do you think? <laughs> Correct. That's my see that. Thank you for that. You're welcome. Give me water to drink. Definitely. Behind every successful man, there's always a woman such as this. Barista. Yeah, <laughs> Barista. Sir, Dad, welcome. My dream has come true. Wow. <laughs> Must be your most precious dream, judging by the excitement <laughs> of your face and the way you're sounding. Yes. How about breaking it down? Well, tell him, please. <laughs> I should? Yes. <laughs> well? Oh! <laughs> Thank God. <laughs> 
you are now my wife. <laughs> so, you're a full woman. Mm. Thank you, sir. And I am now a woman. Yes, a sir. full woman. Yes. You're welcome. Thank you uh, very much, please, sir. Let's go inside. We must dine and wine for this. Yes. <laughs> let's go. Uh -huh. More cheap and open the veil. I like this, your pipe. Uh, let me see it. Uh, uh, if you like this, uh, come to my house. I will give you one. Just let me have a look. Not this one. This one is special. <laughs> no, that's not true. <laughs> I was even... What are you doing here? You stray he good. What are you doing in my compound? Who's my coming? Let's go. Please. We need to leave here now. My uncle would not like this. I beg you. Let's just go. Let's go. Oh my god. You idiot. If you don't get out of my compound now. The next shot will be on your head. Out! At the count of five, if you don't get out of this compound, I will blow your head off. Oko, Otu, Eji, Abuo, Esther, Ato, please just. Any, Ano, you stay here. You don't have to be here. Let's just go. Please. You will have No, you would have stayed. Fool. You would have stayed. You could have waited. Nonsense. I know I'm not here. You would have stayed. And you, Dobo, yes. if you don't get up from here now, I will transfer this aggression to you. Oh, don't do this. Don't I, I just released a shot and you, 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 are, you are down. What if I had shot you? Oh, okay. Get up! Okay, okay. Don't do this. Get up! Dobo is gone. This, this, this is not the issue of much. Hey, Buka. Hey, Buka. Don't try me. I'm going to try you. I'm going to try you. Why would you agree? I'm going to try you. Why would you agree? Why would you agree? You get it back. Very selfless old fool. I do not care the evil power you possess is on your tracks anymore. Don't you ever try standing on the way of my son and Amarachi to the altar. Do not wish the vultures to consume the corpses of both of us. Well, your marriage proposal has my blessing and my support if you wish to know. And I don't care how you feel about it. So, don't try a repeat of what he did to them today again. Don't you try it. I'm hearing some animal noise in my compound, but I don't know. I, 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 I'm not seeing anything. Please, can, can, the, can the gold behind the empty bleed show itself? Are you out of your mind? Are you out of your mind? You want to die in my hand? No, 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 no. You want to die in my hand? You buffoon. Hey! What? Eh? Eh? You want to die? No, 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 please, please. Look at the You want to die in my hand? No, 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 I don't. No, 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 now get out of the Hey, 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 hey. Come back here. Listen. Listen. But you got it. Go and tell your son. Tell that congenital dog you call his son that I said he should stay away from Amarachi, my, my, my niece. If I see him anywhere close to Amarachi again, 
Eh? If I see him anywhere close around again, I will blow up his empty skull with my gun. I'll, I'll do it. Tell him to stay away from that girl. They have nothing in common. He should stay away from, from her. If not, I am going to use my teeth. Whatever I the man who on his manhood. In fact, I am going to do him two favors. I will castrate him and circumcise him the second time. Go and tell him that. Yes. Now get that. Stop, stop, stop this. Oh, please, Uncle G. Stop this madness. Eh? Your niece is ripe for marriage. So also is my son. Stop this. Don't do something that could mar 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 marriage. You are still talking. They arrive for, they are, they are for marriage. No, 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 come back here and say that if you know you're, you're a man. Idiot. No, come back and say it again. What is it? What is it? Are you okay? Are you okay? What is it? Oh, Gucci is a beast, a daredevil. Hi. What happened? Oh, Can you talk Amarato, to me? how do you cope living under the same roof with that beast? Eh? Oh, who is by the grace hey. of God? What, what happened? What oh, happened? did he attack you? Yes. The devil and the dog grabbed my testicles and nearly busted them. Oh. Sorry. Oh. Sorry. You know what? The only thing that will make me bear this pain and humiliation is to see both of you as husband and wife in no distant time. Hi! Uh, um, um, Father, it's okay. Uh, sorry, uh, okay? I'm right. uh. If you go back to that house, tell that beast that we are coming back in five days' time eh? for the wine carrying rights. Hi. Five oh. days? Yes! So quick? Of course! You have been in that hell for too long. It's time to legally get you out of that shit. Huh? In five days time. Oh, do you have any objection, both of you? Huh? Uh, um, um, no, father. Uh, um, please, let's go inside, uh, okay? Uh, let's go in. Uh, uh, no, no, my phone, my phone. Yeah, my phone, phone. Okay. No, I don't, I never knew that this man No, 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 no. Go on, that's it. What is it? I am... Moniki Lode. Ah, what is it? I'm... I'm I just... Um, I just want to apologize about what happened earlier today. I should have acted more responsibly. And then um, Ibuka's father shouldn't have come here to confront you. Please, I... I, I'm sorry, it's all my fault. Please, I am deeply sorry. Please. Uh, uh, Amarachi. Amarachi. Uncle. Your apology is meaningless to me. Just meaningless to me. Except you are giving me your words that you will no longer see uh, a book from today on. Are you promising me that? I, I, I'm sorry, I, I can't promise you that, Uncle. It's too late already. Meaning what? You want to defy your own uncle for that lousy dog? We have a Lenu. Chinny, please stop. Why would you call my own Ebuka a dog? That's not the right word to use on your fellow human. <laughs> your Ebuka. Oh, can you imagine? 
surprised. Oh, I'm actually pregnant. Very obvious. Naya, that is so wrong a thing to say. I am not pregnant. And for goodness sake, you know I am still a virgin. Oh no, I do not know anymore. Because you stand boldly before us and refer to one man as yours. Really? I only said that because I find nothing wrong in calling a man who will come here in five days' time with his kinsmen to ask for my hand in marriage. Mine. Eh? You said what? Kiluso. Onigini. Eh? Is it Gini? Oh, Ibuka and um, Ibuka and his kinsmen will be coming here in five days' time to ask for my hand in marriage. Uncle, that's exactly what I wanted to discuss with you before we deviated. Mugbe, 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 Mugbe. What do I tell them? I don't remember giving you any invitation to my house. So, to what do I owe this your visit? Um, our visit is for good. My son here, Ebuka, yeah. saw a ripe, sumptuous fruit in this household. Yeah. And it is that beautiful Odara that uh, my cousin and I accompanied him for this house. Mm. To ask for as a tradition demands. Mm. Yes. yes. Uh, the truth still means that I inherited so many things from my late brother. Definitely, Odara is not one of them. Uh, my late parent did not leave any for me, neither did I plant anyone myself. So I, I, I don't get this parable or, or uh, 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 idiomatic expression or idiomatic jamboree of Odara and the fruit. Where, 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 where is it coming from? Oguchi. Uh, oh, Oguchi. Oh, hmm? uh, you are the son of the soil. Yes. Uh, I got to the local uh, uh, to forget that one. I know. Forget that one. one. I am a son of the soil. Yes. But that will not make me accept having what I know that I don't have. Um, Mazogine, tell your cousin or your nephew, whatever he is to you, tell him to save me this idiomatic gymnastic and tell me why people are in my house. It's okay. We are here to ask uh, for the hand of uh, Amarachi. Your niece is in marriage. Uh, as required by the ancient tradition of Acha community during such visits. Um, Our wine is before you. Interesting. The matter is getting more and more interesting. Put your dabbe, no? Father Bale Mumbo. Oh, yeah, Kim. Uh, let, let, let me let me 
Let me go there myself. Um, I guess this is the young maiden you people are referring to. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. She's, she's, she's the one. Good. Utobo, allow him. I know the way, I know the, the way we, we, we communicate. Utobo, uh -huh. now that uh, Barzugoji and his cousin, Plosebuka, his son, are here, please, I want you to tell them why you are here in my house today. It's alright. Don't, don't, don't worry, calm down. The show must go on. Yes. This show has not ended, it must go on. Uh, Mazo mm -hmm. please speak for your uh, honorable uh, Kingsman. Why are you people in my house today? Tell them. Yes. Well, uh -huh. I accompanied Otobo. Uh -huh. To your house to ask for marriages and in marriage. Oh. Bam. Yeah. And I have accepted their proposal. God forbid. It's simple. Oh, 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 oh. You lie. What do you mean you've accepted their proposal? Yeah. I am not Utobo's wife and I will never ever get married to you. Says what? Says me. You are his wife. Uh, Chinaya, please. Mm -hmm. You see? Mm -hmm. As you can see. The lady you're looking to ask for hand in marriage is already the king. Oh, it's easier. Oh, it's easier. Yes! 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 We need to deal with him. Eh? Danny George. Where is he? I can't wait to see him. I don't know why an old man like that always wants to make a fool of himself. Stupid man. How am I even supposed to live in the same house as a wife with that old thing? How? A okay. drunk. Oh, I think he's here. That foolish idiot is here. Oh, An open the vest. Hey, come here. Huh? I, 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 oh, what was that for? Eh? You madman, what was that for? You madman. Now listen to me and listen good. This would be the last time we would... Shift away! I'm coming on you still. I'm, I'm not talking, you're coming close. This would be the last time we would come here to warn you verbally. Don't you ever come to my uncle's house to ill to ask for my hand in marriage. I am warning you. Marching and open the vet. Oh, Hi. you are still marching. Hi. Why not? I love Congo. Hey! My old wife, even right before my eyes. You are married to a spirit and not to me. Do I look like a wife to you? Do I look like your wife? Yes. Now listen and get this into your face, school. I am not married to you and would never be married to you. Stay away from me. Else the next time we'll come to this house, it will be to have sex right in front hey. of you. Hey! You dare not. Hmm. Yeah, young man. Young man, stay away from my wife or... Or what? I stand you or what? Eh? Are you mad? Are you, are you talking to me that way? Eh? Are you... 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 It's okay, listen to me. A wasted soul like this should not die in the hands of my own husband. So just leave him. 
Leave this wasted fool. Let's go. Idiot. This is the last time I will warn you verbally, like I said. I you. Had to. The next time I... won't be funny. I... Stupid old drunk. Let's go. I... Let, let, old let, let, old buffoon. Let's go. Let me tell you this, man. You don't need to do that. You don't need him. Let's go. Let me tell you this, man. Let's just go. Let's go. Let me tell you this, idiot. Let us go. Let me. Ebuka. Ebuka, let's go. Let's go. Hold on. Let me. Let me. Ebuka, let's go. What is that? Fool! What did he just do? What did he just do? What did he just What did he just do? 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 What did he just if you think I am bluffing, go and ask Marzia Lozier. Hi. Hi. I'll open the man. <laughs> oh, you think I am bluffing? That, that is my wife, my sweetheart. <laughs> My love, oh darling. <laughs> oh, oh, come, come, come. Oh, don't you have no? Oh, yeah, no. Hey, come, let me see what you Eh, yeah, no. Oh, hmm. That you talk to Uncle Lokochi. <laughs> Beg him for me. I cannot marry that old man. Please. <laughs> if 
you do this for me, I swear to God, I will do anything to make you. Why don't you just save everybody the stress and explain to her exactly how complicated her marriage to Utobo has become to her? I am not married to Utobo for goodness sake. I am not. The man in question here did not pay my bride price, did he? I mean, there was never a time I said yes either in action or words to becoming his wife. I mean, I didn't even hear about this until today. And you two know that that video you showed the others was a manipulation taken too far. My dear, Utobo paid your bride price way before now. Tikwe, tikwe. How? I mean, when did this happen? How? Yes. When? Yes. Okay. Since you don't, let me explain to you. Who do you think brought the money I gave to you to pay for your vocational training? What? Yes, even the money for transportation and feeding that I've been giving you, where do you think it came from? Utubu brought them. Yes. Isn't it enough bright price for ordinary Udele, Igu, Anglu, Apple Mary like you? Eh? Even for prettier maidens, have you ever heard that anybody paid as much as that money as bright price in a challenge? Have you? Bo, uh, uh, okay. Not at all. I didn't even thought that she will be so happy and grateful when the time comes that she will run to Togo's house and start giving him children left, right, front and center. Oh yeah, Milenu. Not knowing she will kneel here saying this rubbish. Enough, Chini. Enough of this arrant nonsense. Listen, having inherited everything my father left, including his thriving produce business, our tradition demands that you take care of my every need, everything. But no, you failed in that regard. Peace of mind and dignity of any kind you demand. You are sitting on my father's sweat. As if that was not enough, you collected money from that good for nothing. Oh, Jesus. I have just one question to ask you. Have you no fear of the anger of God? Have you no fear of the anger of the dead? I mean, how could you? How could you? Hey! Good day, Maraji. Sweetie, time for our siesta. Exactly. They can also. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Hey! Hey! In my late parents' bedroom. Uh -huh. Have you bothered to ask yourself if I will ever sleep again or not? Now I'm going to make this clear. I want you, I mean two of you, to calculate whatever it is that old fool spent on me. Because I am going to pay everything ten times over. My able couple. It's okay. I believe you. That video is not true. 
whatever you saw there, they are all lies. I was manipulated. I didn't. I didn't intentionally do anything. I didn't know. I did not know. It's okay. I did not know. I did not know. I swear, I did I, not know. I, I believe you. Okay, I believe you. It's okay. It's okay. Stop crying. Stop. 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 How could they? How could those folks? How could those conniving loafers be this mean to an innocent girl? Ebuka, calm down. Calm down. Father, I should calm down. How? How, Father? After all that happened today, I should calm down? Ebuka, in a situation like this, a real man puts up a fight and wins his woman, not swearing and raging. Think of what to do to get her to be your wife if you really love her. Talking and not taking action is no longer an option. Father, are you telling me to go into a physical fight with those idiots? After all that happened with Utubo Oleron? Ebuka, a man who fights only physically for what he wants is no difference from a cow. Put your brain to work, Ebuka. Whatever plan you come up with to end this madness, you will have my support. Before anything else, I would like to give Amarachi double the estimated cost of her vocational training to personally take it to Utobo. What do you say? Support it. Thank you. <laughs> it's okay, babe. Babe, 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 babe right? It's okay. Stop. 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 So honestly, I I don't know why you had this discussion with me. If if I knew that you were going to give him money, I I, I swear I wouldn't have allowed you to do it. Well, I I'm not here to blame anybody. I'm here to return your money. Every penny you give to my uncle with huge interest. Please. You are joking, aren't you? I'm not joking. In fact, I... I have your money here with me. Everything. This is 200,000 Naira. The whole money you gave to my uncle for my vocational training. And oh, he said you also paid for my bride price. Please, just take it and let me be. Allow me have my peace, please. Mochi and open the veil. <laughs> Sorry, my dear. I don't need the money. All I need is you as my wife and the mother of my children. What's up? Iko, I am begging you. I cannot be with you. Look at us, how are we supposed to live in the same house as husband and wife? So for goodness sake, you are old enough to be my father. Even my grandfather. Besides that, I don't love you. I don't have feelings for you. Please just let me be. Let me be with the man I love. Please, Utobo. Oh. Amarachi. Don't 
맞춰봐 Amarachi, <clears throat> the feeling is mutual. I don't love you either. What I want is two things you are carrying. I'm sorry. I'm confused. What are you talking about? I gave your uncle money for your ame gurigu and oba milk. Cut the two. Give them to me. Then I will allow you. I will reverse all that I have done. I will allow you to go and marry Ebuka. Just give me. Utubo Mugurugu will allow you. Can you just shut? Wait a minute. I need to understand where you are coming from. Hmm? You want me to cut off my breasts hmm? and my womanhood? Yes. And give them to you? Wow! Wow! Okay, fine. You want me to cut off my breast, right? And my womanhood. Yes. And give them to you. Mm -hmm. It's okay, let me have them. Let me have them. Let me have them. Let me have this. To show you how much I hate you, I am going to cut off my breast and my womanhood. And lets you have them. I hope that makes you happy. Bam! Nemnya, I will allow you go. I am going to cut them off and give them to you. But before I do that, I am going to cut off your manhood and force it down your wicked throat. Raise your hand. Hey, 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 I'm not. Just allow me. Allow me. Allow me. You this wicked man. If you ever come anywhere close to me, I will break your Let me just allow me cut off his manhood and force it down his throat. After that, I will commit suicide so that you and my uncle can roll out the drums and celebrate your victory. Okay. Uh, uh, please. Oh, my steps, okay. Pen. Okay. Right, it's okay. Please. It's okay. Stop. Oh, oh, my dear. Oh, dear. Just let me take the life of this. Bastard, I want to ruin my life. Oh my dear. I am sick and tired. There is nothing else I can do. Oh my dear. Hi. I'm up on Hi. Hey, whoa. Hi. Hi. Mochi and open the veil. You won't believe it. He took the intervention of a book of four people for Amarachi to back down. Otherwise, Mumabu Otobo Wamburogu, Kareta Udugwa Kataka Moka Jita, Amarachi would have made Nkobi with my Agabidu, Udugu Jagadi Hedjo Mimi, and force it down my throat. Yeah, okay. Is she? That heartless. It is that boy. It is Ebuka. Mm -hmm. They planned it all to humiliate you and stop us. Yes. But they have failed. Woefully. They have failed. Failed? Woefully. You mean Amarachi will be submissive to my manhood and she will not threaten it again? She will have no other choice than to. Just choose a date for your wedding and let us stop this madness once and for all. Yeah, okay. The Amarachi I saw today in my compound, she is ready to kill in order to drive down her point. Listen. 
I am not ready to be the one to kill. Uh, uh, I mean, that scale is invisible. Listen, that girl is my niece. My wife and I know her very well. She's only trying to scare you off. She doesn't have all the courts to do that. Eh? Really? Yes. Bo, sweet him. Well, it seems to me like Utubu here is not even serious oh. with his intention to marry her. Oh. Mo, she and open the veil. Mo, she and open the veil. Yeah, why? Who said so? I knew being cha 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 since I came back from Panya. I want to marry her. If not for any other thing, let me just relieve the overload in between my legs. Baby, baby, Otobo, I don't like this. What is the meaning of this now? Huh? What, what, what is the meaning of this? What, what does this mean? See, let me tell you something. There's a limit to what I take from a friend. Definitely, this is not one of, one of them. How can you be telling my wife since he was a woman that I opened here? And you may. Can you give me this here? Huh? Yeah, 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 I'm okay. I'm too good, too, 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 too. Sit down. Sit down. Eh? It's okay. I am sorry. I am sorry. Uh, just choose a date for the wedding. That is the most important thing now. Just choose a date. Hi! Oh, and up and the veil. Otobo, Mao Borogu, Ureno Mume. But we do. Which date do I take now? Uh, say six days from now. How do you see that? Wow, Ija. Accepted. Hi, Amarachi. <laughs> Just wait for me. Uh, because Engi Jodo Gua we we pagi rayo to do. <laughs> That's your fight, who can get you, Dogum, or Dogun Jagani, and yet your baby. Where drug, a drug, a drug. Yes, uh, uh, that day of our wedding, Cherum, Cherum. Oh, no, bro. It's all right. Uh -uh. The mother is a little now. Can't you see that there's a woman here that I missed you? Okay, I'm sorry, but I'm allowed to shoot it for you. That day of our wedding. <laughs> Tobo's wife, ain't you? Wow. I mean, just wow. So it's you. It is me, oh. It's me. Here? Take a look at the ages of the children you co-opted into your dance of shame. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Eh? I'm actually may thunder that is hungry pieces that are mother for me. May it pieces your mother match and may it blast the living daylight out of you. Blast your mama, blast everything. Complete that different and everyone will marry your carcass. I'll get vulture. Don't run. Say it. Baby, blast her already! No. Say it. too much! Just last week you threatened to Don't come any closer. Over same issue. Don't come closer. What do you want from me? Why are you so eager to ruin my life? What have I done? Oh, to you? shut up! Shut up! Go inside and stop it being for your wedding, Dodobo. What? I'll say so. What is going on here, for goodness sake? Dodobo, look at you. Dodobo, look at you. Oh, money. Look at you. You're just so ungrateful. Very ungrateful. Look at these children that left what they should be doing for their parents. Cracking their head and composing songs they will present to you on your wedding day. Instead of you to be appreciative of them, you are here harassing them. Children, children! Children! Baby! Baby! 
Eh? What? Amarachi is nowhere to be found. She's impossible. not anywhere in this compound. Though. That is impossible. Ah. Where could she be? I mean, today is her wedding day, and the Utubo and his kinsmen will soon be here. Even our invited guests. We'll go and look for her everywhere. We'll search everywhere. Are you not hearing what I am saying? I said she is nowhere to be found. All her vital belongings are not even in her room. What? Hi! Marty has played the first one or not, she has escaped. Let's go before her. You won't go scot free. Oh, Gucci. I'm Oh, Gucci. My money. Oh, Gucci. My money. Mochi. Oh, Gucci. Oh, Gucci. You could go remotely that I ate my excrete and drank my urine for 14 days and 14 nights to acquire. Like a quest asset that I spiritually eliminated him, his wife, and kidnapped and held their only son hostage. The reputation of a powerful man who can never be ever challenged by anyone without deadly consequences in Acha. The joy of charming and marrying a pretty girl young enough to be my grandchild. After all that, this is how everything came crashing down in one shameful heap. Amarachi, a girl I thought that I had so poisoned her life that I have literally dug her grave waiting for the day she would drop dead in frustration is now swimming in victory. Why me? Oguchi is swimming in shame. Ah, Omashio, what a humiliation. What a disgrace. Not done with wounding my pride seven months ago by eloping with my niece on her wedding day and going ahead to get her pregnant in Canada. That boy and his father also went a step further by paying and bringing soldiers to torture and utterly humiliate Tobo and I when we went to their house with youth of Acha we hired to forcefully take Amaraji back. They pulled us out of their compound. After that, people of Acha, including the elders of the land, also booed Tobo and I. And we went to them to complain. Aguchi. Aguchi. The snake you cut into half has beaten you in public. That is so good. Agbojoru, Ebuka, his son, and Amalachi, they get you and your wife called Udele. Akui or De Tendene. Another countless derogatory names have stripped you naked in public. Accept this doing nothing and you have become a living dead in nature. Allow them to succeed and, and Ekekwe, his wife and Henry will have the last laugh at you. No. I would rather die than let this reality be. Yes. It will never stand. Oguchi. 
in me Oguchi. I'm ready. I am ready for the war you have started. I'm ready. Ibuka, I'm ready to gorge. And we have also fulfilled tradition by eating the kola nut and taking the drink he has presented to us. Now is the time for us to go into the substance of the issue that brought us here. Yes. Barista Goji, over to you now. Okay, mother. I thank you very much, uh, Mazi Aloze. Thank you. Again, I want to apologize uh, for the role my son and I played uh, in this house seven months ago. Uh, we should have been more diplomatic uh, with the whole issue. And um, I also want to thank Oguchi for backing down finally and allowing us into his house to do what we are here to do today. Hmm. Having said that, uh, I want to state our mission. In a nutshell, we are here for a repeat of our aborted mission in this house seven months ago. You're right. <laughs> my son, Ebuka, is here with me. And my cousin, Ogene. Ogene? Yes. <laughs> yes, so we are here finally to formally ask for the hands of uh, Marachi in marriage. Mm. Nothing more than that. Mm. Uh, if you need to. Good. Mm. <laughs> Noble intent. Yes, yes. Oguchi, over to you. No, no. A couple. Um, oh, you can. Ah, then, yeah. What do My people, I greet you. Yes. You're welcome. Uh, there's no point, no need asking the, the routine question. Uh, right standing before us here, here, it's obvious there was a rest too. And the evidence is clear as to who threw the other. Hey, you can't walk him. You can't walk him. Imozo. Give me the joy. Imozo. Ugoji. Agbejoru. Emuru. I am in tears. Oh, my can near Kobo. I must say sincerely. Yes. But unfortunately for all of you, he just wasted his semen and strength. Yes. On him. Yes. Yes. I did it. This is quite opprobrious. Let it be. I said it seven months ago, and I am saying it again today, louder and clearer. Uh, she is already married to uh, Utobo. But that is a life from the pits of hell, and you know it. It's yes. true. It's true, Marachi. And going by my tradition, even in her womb, plus Utobo. Uh. And you, you, let me see you close to her again. I piangam, baby, 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 baby. If you have problem, yes. What is this fool talking about? Who is this fool talking about? No, 
so I know how you feel. So, wipe your tears. I know how you feel. I truly do. But the others have said it the way it is. But it's time for us to accept the reality. Anyhow you look at it, by what Okuchi did today, he has won. Father, I do not care. Huh? Oh yes, I don't care what you guys are talking about, the implication of what that fool did. Amarachi is my woman, and Amarachi is the one I will marry. Marry her as a corpse, or as a living being? Nothing will happen to me. Nothing will happen to me. Our love will conquer. Nothing will happen to me. Sir, unless Oguchi reverses what he did today, if you have sex with Amarachi, you will die instantly. Yes. Father, are you the one saying this? A lawyer like you? Let me cancel. I've seen this happened before, son. I've seen a man lose his only son in a similar case. But I cannot stand aside and watch my only son to suffer the same fate. No. Go against my wish. I'll commit suicide for you. I'll never live to bury you, Rebuka. No. Father, do you remember how you fought to and nail to marry my mother because you love her? Do you still remember that? Amarachi, the woman we are talking about, is the only surviving child of Chief Ekekwe, my late childhood friend. How does that man get me to stand aside and watch my only son destroy my lineage all in the name of his daughter. How? Father, a member of your lineage is in the womb of the girl you're telling me to forget. Did you forget that? Ebuka, a child that tradition has effectively taken away from you is not your child. Life is more important to me than Amarachi and Tobo, stop following me. Stop following me. I'm warning you. Leave me alone. I'm warning, this is the last time I'm going to warn you. I don't want to harm you. Leave me alone. What is wrong with you? I should leave you alone. Mochi and open the vet. Mochi. Madman. Leave me alone, no. Idiot. Keep, 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 keep following me. Mochi and open the veil. Why, Yoma? Hey, Odala Micha. Aku Gomu. Leave me alone. I am still warning you. Leave me alone. I should leave you alone. I will not leave you alone because you are my wife. Odala Micha. Why, Yoma? Yes. Yes. We are come close. No, come. Yes. Yeah. Tobo, if you don't go back now, I, I, I will send one that to strike you. Oh. What is it? Let me alone now. Is it from Kaduna or from Yola? Tell me. Oh, is it from Kaduna or from Yola? This one. Oh, oh. Let, let me alone. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. That, that, that serves oh. you right. Idiots. 
No go and look for your age mate to, to get married to. More to up and the up and the kill you dear. No problem. Hey, my love, love, ma. Hey, hey. Let me carry my surplus. Hey, more to and up and the up and down. Oh oh. Utobo, go after your wife. Hey, Utobo. Go after your wife. <laughs> yeah. More chin and open the vest. Just stop following you. Stop it. What's going on here? What's happening? Why? Why do you have my bags outside? Kamarachi, the pill that your uncle and this fool that came with you are forcing down my truth. It's bitter indeed. But I've decided to swallow it, having no other option, having no other way out of it. Nevertheless, I still love you. But I'm... I'm sorry. It's over between us. Yes. Let's go home. Hey, sorry. Hey, stop, stop. I'm uh, I'm uh, uh, Don't kill my wife. I'm not Don't just kill my wife. Shut up. Don't just shut up. And me show me by your so they can do one. Look at your beers. Don't kill my wife. Let's go home. Amarachi, let's go. Call, call. Please, call the hospital. Please, please, please. Don't kill my wife. Uncle Okuchi, in the last four hours, I have been begging you. I have been pleading. Please just let me be with the man I love so much. Allow me be with Ebuka, but no, you have bluntly refused. I had to beg Uncle Alosi here to come and plead with you. To please let me be. Free me, Uncle. Save me. Allow me be with the man who I truly love. Allow me be with Ebuka. Uncle, please, if I have done anything wrong to you, forgive me. For the sake of my late parents, just let me be with the man I truly love. Please, be cool. Hey, 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 hey. 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 If you mean me if you want to know you ever trust me, you a job for long day. And you, Amaraji, why are you so heartless and wicked? Eh? Why are you so heartless and wicked? You are married. You are married to Tubo, and Tubo you are married to. We is waiting for you in your matrimonial home. Why are you stabbing him off? The sweetness of kisses. Amy Ono. He's waiting for you to, 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 to give him that passionate kiss that will bring up the man in him. Eh? Why are you punishing him this way? It's unfair. Baby. Sweetheart. Continue. Oh. I'm just telling me. Oh. Oh, Gucci, this is not good at all. <laughs> Remember, we missed you. You're a woman like me. They said our parents were running for their dear lives. When they saw you crying over the corpses of your own parents, who were hacked to death during a bloody crisis in Kaduna. Actually, my parents risked their life risked my own life and that of Henry. Picked 
you up in the midst of that violent riot. <laughs> I was just a year old. And she were barely three months. <laughs> My parents had the option of dumping you in an orphanage. But no. <laughs> you were adopted. I mean, they didn't do that because they were childless. After all, they had Henry and I. They took you in because they loved you. They did everything they could to locate your own family, but they couldn't. <laughs> they loved you like you were their own child. I loved you. I loved you from the deepest part of my heart. I loved you to the point that we did not even know that we were not biological sisters until the death of our own parents. We did everything together. We cried and we laughed together. We went to school, we freely shared our secrets. We played in the sand together. I loved you. I had your back and you always had mine. What happened? Please, I'm begging you. Don't touch me. Be cool. Be cool. I'm begging you. Please help me, Bevo. Go, please. I am begging you, Miko, please. Help me talk to Uncle Oguchi, Miko. Please look, consider. Miko. <laughs> consider. This is your own person. Please. Uh, wait a minute. Have I been the one you've been talking to all this while? I have been talking to you. Oh, what a waste of time. Oh, yeah, Mileno. Did I hear you say waste of time? You heard Bam. Uh... Excuse me, Frida. Mm. Oh, good chief. Excuse me, Dad. You are quite excused. Egbo? Me very new you. Me very new you. I don't want to insult you. If, if, if not because I, I, I don't like to insult elderly people. If not because you are our Lord I would have said you are Agbaya. I would have called you Agbaya. But because I don't like to insult elderly people. What is Agbaya? Agbaya is a, is a useless, worthless and hopeless elder. Yes. Close your gun. Close your gun. You have already said it. I have not called you that. I said I would have called you, but I have not called you. See, I'm a, I'm a bow. I'm a button on you. I'm ashamed. Are you not ashamed of yourself? Why are you so shameless, by the way? Eh? Why are you so shameless, Egmo? Eh, eh? I'm so ashamed of you. Tell me, how much did this, this drenched vulture here and Ebuka bribe you with? That made you come here to fool yourself the way you're doing. Eh? Egbo Aloje, Kilo Dien Shenyi Go. Anyway, anyway, as far as I'm concerned, your own is a failed mission. Because I will never, Oguchi, Oguchi Kuna Amara Mwanya, will never do as you wanted. What is this? Wo, Mo Ben Yo, E Yara Fum Yo, Hey, you're not me. Stay off my path. Look, 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 they go. Maybe. Uh, let, 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 let. Let's get. Huh? Uh, uh, Amarashi, don't worry. Stand up. Let's go. Let's go. The gods are watching. Uh. Even your dead parents are also watching. Oh, good, 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 good,
The dead is dead. Dad. Mom. For reasons best known to you, you have kept mute and watched me eat the bread of sorrow that Uncle Okuchi and Chineye have forced down my throat. And you did nothing. You have watched me cry till my tears could flow no more. You have watched me bleed emotionally and physically from wounds inflicted on me by Uncle Oguchi and Chimehe. And none of these made you to act. I don't know why. And I am not here to ask why. I am only here to give you a piece of information. I am going right away to Utobo's house to plead with him to leave me alone for the final time. The final time, I said. I don't know your reason for not acting up against Chineya and Uncle Okuchi. Please. I beg you. Rise up against the Tobo. At least let him listen to whatever I have to say. <laughs> let him leave me alone. I've suffered too much. <laughs> Else, be ready to receive me wherever you are.
Open the veil. I said it. Mochi that open the veil. Otobo is a prophet. I prophesy that you will come. You will voluntarily come to me. So both of us will live our lives as husband and wife. Welcome to your home. Welcome to your matrimonial home. <laughs> Hmm? Kiss me, for I deserve it for being so patient. Good supper. Please, I am begging you. If you have a heart, if you have blood flowing through your veins, if you ever sucked a woman's breast. Odaran, please stand up, stand up. What do you want from Utobo, your love? Freedom. Please free me to be with the man I love. I want to be with the man after my heart, please. Mochi, I open the veil. Don't tell me you are here to talk about that wife kidnapper again. He is not a wife kidnapper, Mazi. That is the man after my heart. The father of my unborn child. Mazi, go. I am begging you. Just go to my uncle. Tell him you are not interested in marrying me anymore, please. Mochi and open the veil. Mochi! And open the veil. Amarachi, I have told you that your tears, your plea, whatever you come with, will not stop us from becoming husband and wife. Now listen, Amarachi, it is only death that will do us part. I mean, only death. That will do us part. <sighs> Only death, you see, right? <sighs> Only death shall do us part, you said, Marcy. <sighs> Only death, right? I would rather kill myself than be with you. I can never ever spend the rest of my life with you, never. Baby.
Ah ah. Il me le Qui l'a enjambé Tu as le quoi Ok. I don't know. Just happened now. Ah, ça. 